Okay, you guys. So we're gonna be starting a new Let's Play, you guys. Um, this is the bed that we made featuring me, Nicholas Richard. I'm so excited to be playing this tonight. The trailer for this game honestly looked pretty good. Did K-pop play this? Is it good? Nuni, I think Nuni Banuni, yeah, Nuni Banuni told me to play this. It better be good, because that last game, oh, by the way, my uh, refund for Class of 09 went through, so we love that. I'm a zero. Thank you so much, Gorgia Girl. Guy. I'm gonna watch House of Villains after. I'm probably gonna play this for like an hour or two, and then we're gonna watch House of Villains. I kind of stalled for a while, though. House of Villains tonight, or I'm going to crawl onto your pissed soap the game mattress and in the night, tickle your and toes, and then cut your leg off in serious I'm outside your house right now. I have a knife. Don't mess with me. The part of the day, A part of the day, A part of the day, A part of the day, Please! <laughs> oh! I'm a female girl with a little f nose! Ugh, I look like Kesha, but like Olga K. Kesha. Let's keep moving. Okay, here we go. I don't really know what this game is about, but oh, this is such a little meek little walk. Like, I'm a little meek girl, I'm gonna lay a little egg. Oh, if I could lay an egg right now, I would, bitch. Oh my god, it probably feels so good to lay a little egg right now. Oh, that'd be such right. a really- Here. Okay. 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 Oh, sorry. Okay. 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 Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know what year this was. Well, this is back when females had self respect and actually didn't show their b to everyone. It's all yours, sir. Sophie Roy, I'm Detective Maurice Trump. That's Miss Sophie Roy to you! That's a rough 21. But back then, they used to die at 30, because cancer and other things, like plague. I live with my mother. That's a rough 21, though. I have to take care of her. No father. No. It's always just been me and my mom. All right, Miss Roy. Too quiet? She does look old. She needs a long winter's nap. That's what it's get. A long hibernation will get her nice and good. Okay, how about this, you guys? I need you to tell me. Is that better? That She's happened. a Lanny Del Rue with a little fringe. Uh, uh, there was a murder of a human murderer. <laughs> I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. Good morrow, my fine feathered lady. What does thou heart of desire on this fine eve? A hundred dollars. Documents done. Now just a bit of tidying up, and I can go on break. So we're German. Are we German? Or are we from Hungary? Okay. We need to clean up a little bit here. This place is a mess. Oh, period. There's a little shit stain. A little shit. It's a little shit on this car. A little shit stain. Oh, I love this game. It's like cleaning. Oh, I love that. Some of the girls here need to do this to their fritter holes. Their little stinking to dinkin' ones. Damn, that's really stained though. Good shit. I'm gonna make the bed here. Very comfortable looking bed. But that's not complete without its pillow. I need to get the pillow though. Okay, here we go. Bitch, this bob is really fierce though. This, what kind of haircut is this? A little old maiden type of haggard moment. A little Amish girl. It's giving them um, the Oregon Trail. I'm gonna clean this all up. 
Oh, I'm stupid. You, you just fell know. out of a coconut tree. Thank you so much, Kuma. <laughs> Thank you so much. Regretfully, we are to inform. Hello, hot babe, fucking boyfriend, big nose husband, love you, Nick Dom nose. Thank you so much, sweetie patooties. Regretful, we are to invert the lines of communication to our client and the neighbor in the 80 second and the ultimately evasive in attempts in the 1,000 and the lipless reports and contact and this and that and little desire to disturb in the offer and the citizens and the business and back in the neighborhood and quickly and this and that. Okay, so he owes money to um, a debtor. A debtor, if you don't know, if you're young. A debtor is somebody who you get money from, but then they want it back with interest. So that's a de actually called a, de a, de a debtor. That's actually a debtor. Why is the mirror covered? Oh, we're a fucking vampire, honey. Oh my god. If I was a maid, I would put, put people's toothbrush in my pussy and put it back. How are they ever to know? Clean, 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 but I. Is that clean? And voila. Okay, that's clean. Good as new. Put that back. We're not a very, very good maid. Like, this place still looks like shit, honestly. Oh! Please clean! It's cool. Can this Is radio song? Best dad. I guess ours oh aren't quite God. as complimentary. Oh, there's a little um, shit in there. This radio is overwhelming me, honestly. Towel over the mirror. Not you leaving the water tap on. Well, I'm gonna tap it like sweet. Oh! I think I'm. Okay, can this radio go off? It's like a little too much. I can't focus. There. Oh, isn't that better, you guys? Oh my god, that's so much better. There's like a little woman in here. If this was the real 1901s, she would jump out of the window. Oh my god, I'm a sullen girl. Like Fiona Apple. Just like staring out the window, like so upset. I'm like such a sullen girl, like Fiona Apple. These give you cancer. If you have these in your house, well, put that sub on auto renew, please. Okay, so see, it was a, um, a dead editor. It was a dead editor. So he is getting some money. So he's initial amped and he borrowed some money and look, the interest is 15%. So he borrowed some money, but he's overdue with some money and there's an interest on that as well for July. So he's late on paying his money back. Um, that's not genuine. They will kill you in these times for hmm. some money. Only men's wear. Men kill other men for, a for business money. Trip, maybe? You know me, you know my family, you have a seat, you're 49, your friends talk, your friends are polite, your family deserves, I'm direct, you're la- You owe us 8K? Is now eight months overdue, my patients had ward thin, like a little bitch's hairline, like light plus indie hairline? This isn't like one of your unpaid bar tabs. We spend our pockets and times, and there were advantages taken of us in person. And there was a collection coming, and the boys are coming for a chat. They're not good with words. Oh my god, who just has $8,000? Like, what the fuck? Like, who just has that kind of money lying around, honestly? Besides Pokey Mains, that is. Me? 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 Well, I don't know. You guys should be a little bit more generous. 8K back then was like 1 million. Oh, you were there, you old piece of shit? You were alive in the 50s, weren't you? Because you're like 80, aren't you? 80 and still a twink. Ugh, that's not good. Who brings their kid to a hotel? That's where they get stolen in the night and kidnapped. I think that's everything, mama. Like, I think I'm good. Did I get everything? How do I know? It's called history class. Oh, so you're a little fucking jealous girl. Look at this rouge. Oh, that rouge though. Oh my god, our body's done up though. It's giving Dr. Miami. Sims 5 looks so bad. We're kind of pretty though. If like we had a 10 fucking facelifts. Oh my god. Oh fuck, we heard a little fucking thing. Pardé d'Alfran? Pardé d'Alfran? Oh fuck. 
our little tights. Have you heard about that nut house they want to build next door? Oh my god, yeah, that is Susan. Imagine all the weirdos who start hanging around the hotel. <laughs> I can oh think of someone who will write Hey, that's Maria Antoinette! <laughs> What judgy fucking bitches are these? Put the fucking block out. Well, Back in the day, everyone had a rifle. You need to get your excitement somewhere. These judgy fucking bitches. I'm gonna put my their toothbrush on my pussy. Like seriously? No, toothbrush on pussy mode. Oh Jacks and Wendy's. Oh, Jack in the Box and Wendy. Sophie speaking. Hey. We're so meek. Do you think you could come up? Beth is a lesbian name. Uh, Every girl sure. named Beth, it has broad there. shoulders and ginger hair, and like she wears like Uggs and like one of them little raccoon hats. It's very Beth coded. Very Beth coded. We left our key. Oh my god. Every French girl's name is Sophie, not me. My name is Maria. Okay, what is this? My See thoughts? What Beth wanted to talk about. Okay, Beth. Where's Beth? Is she in the shitter having a shit? No, she's not having a little noo noo. A little nee nee leaks. The Valentine's ball. Corn of coal. Oh, no one should be stuck coal. cleaning up. Is that Beth? Hey, Beth. Oh, that is. Oh, my God. Oh, she's got a fear. She's got a fear. Sleep. What? She's old but we pretty. Just now on the phone. This so is the game I thought I was gonna play. Napping in the break room again. Oh yeah, no, it's Jacques and Wendy. She is giving lesbian. They though. were, um, in the middle of something. Oh, Ugh, God. it's so awkward when they start making out like no one's watching. I hate green eyes. Get a room. We literally. Okay, pay, pay attention. Pay attention. It's important. They weren't kissing. I ignored them. What is she talking about? I missed it. I was telling you guys to pay attention. What? What's going on? Gay. Oh, they were. Oh, two men. <sighs> well, they won't be permanent residents. You know the kind of disease that walks amongst that crowd. Beth. And then Beth slapped me because she's a sapphic queen. Um, I'm not going to goss about other people. I'm just going to play it very meekly, very, like, tinky. You said you needed me? Yeah, oh, like, you need me to, like, straight to business, then. Plunge. Sorry, it's just a busy day. I get it. It's been nonstop for me this morning, too. A little Beth hole. Want to guess why I summoned you here? Whose Beth hole is wet right now? <laughs> <clears throat> Something to I'm clean. I'm guessing there's something I have to clean. <laughs> Obviously. But what is it? Your diaper? Uh, did a kid throw up again? God, no. Did that happen recently? <clears throat> yeah, last week. Oh my god. I can still smell it. Feel it too. While I was cleaning, some of it got... Uh, I'm gonna stop you right there. So we're like Keep a little talking, maid. And you'll be cleaning up after me too. So, so far oh. I think we're like a little maid Sorry. or something. Yeah, no, you'll be glad to know it's nothing gross this time. A nice gentleman decided it was time to redesign the lobby and helped us by knocking over that face on the Oh, floor. fuck. That's it? I would do it myself. That's the not last good time for I nature, because now that plant Bernard has no water for that. from his lair to scold me about procedures and whatnot. Well... We can't have the beauty of the Clarington Hotel take absence from her mm, throne, that's true. can we? She Some is. People would riot. She's giving me kind Bernard of bell from actually, Beauty and the Beauty <laughs> and the Beast. Hardly the people. Anyway, I have to get back to work. Yeah, you There's do. There's a mop much. in the supply closet next to Bernard's office, I think. Okay. Thanks. I'll see you around. They're not gay girls. I think Beth might be a gay girl because she's talking about gay men and like you know one in the same. But Sophie's not a gay girl. Do you see how meek I walk? This walk is giving me, like, I need dick to help me loosen up badly. Like, a big, like, Trevor or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's kind of what it's giving. But Beth is giving, like, quite lesbian vibes. Like, the shoulders and the short hair and the cut nails, you know? That's giving kind of, like, gay girl shit. <clears throat> that smell. Okay, where is St. Bernard's if closet? Only we're allowed in there. God, I'm just a little maid and, girl. Uh, Wendy's great at her job. Guests absolutely love her and... Huh, 
Nutch's guest, apparently. Oh god damn it, Linda! I only like her Someone's because getting like fired! Sure guests are happy is my job after all. You don't seem to care whether I'm happy. Listen, if Wendy wasn't doing her job, that'd be another story, but I can't just fire her without good reason. Who's Wendy? Oh! Curiosity killed the cat. Oh! Anyway, Not Ginger Snap. I, I, I was. I mean, I'm sorry. I was just spying on her. Ooh! No, I. I what a I, jolly little thing! I, I, hey, hey, hey! It's okay. I'm just pulling. Oh, what a jolly little thing! I'm. He got I'm rosacea. Sorry. I'm just. I, I'm oh not used to God. having. People that that, that kind of looks like Ariana Grande's yeah, your new boyfriend. Always working alone up there, aren't you? I actually think it's the first time I've seen you down in the lobby. Oh Don't tell me you've been sent to clean up after the Valentine's Day ball. Oh my god, you know George Washington would have fucked that boy whole up. That boy pussy would not be safe. Like, you know that boy pussy is ready to go, though. George Washington style. Like, splinter from the wooden teeth and everything, honey. Heart, right? Mm hmm. Actually, Beth just called me here. Like, she's like flirting. No, Beth called me. A guest knocked over a vase and made a mess. Honestly, in the lobby. Sophie's cute. Yeah, I saw that catastrophe happen. Just what we need, huh? <laughs> Sophie's oh, cute. I'd rather be doing that than cleaning the reception hall with Nicole. Yeah, fuck Nicoleism. Oh, yeah, I don't even want to see the state of the place after this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The fountains are for dipping, but I did That's a gay to find someone's shoe in there. How? <laughs> no idea. You must see plenty of weird stuff too, right? I'm not giving yeah. up my goss. What's the weirdest thing you found in a guest room? I'm not telling you. You just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> Something about <laughs> you. Ooh. Thank you so much, doll. Thank you so much. Well, there was this lady who had a love letter addressed to someone I know. What? No way. A, a lady what? likes him? You. You're messing with me. But he has a two head. <laughs> it was worth seeing your face turn red. Wow. <laughs> His face is me. always red. I think he has Rosane Shaw's. Oh. I uh I better go help. Him. I would love to work in a it's hotel. I feel like working in a hotel it's would be okay. so fun. I need to um Yeah. yeah Alright. Take care. Like honestly, dream job. Dream job. He kinda looks like the guy from Shameless, but more like one of his parents was a marshmallow. Okay. Uh, Bobby made it very clear he doesn't like anyone walking into his kitchen. Where's the map? Where's the map? Okay, here's the map. We got the map. Do we need a... Where's the bucket? Where's the bucket? Where's the bucket? Oh, there. I need that bucket, Mama. Mama, the party. Larva. Larva? W... Wendy plus... <laughs> I've never seen Wendy's gonna get fired. Wendy plus. What was the. Oh, Bernard. Never so. mind. Who's Jay? Maybe another female. Mm. It's a little bit sapphic. Okay, I don't think we need a bucket. Maybe. I'm not sure. Oh, Jax. How do you say that name? Jaquiz? I'm really sorry about that. Jaquiz? Have a word with our kitchen staff to make sure. Is that Jaquiz? Jaquiz. Well. Jaquise, here you Jaquise. <gasps> Time to clean. Oh my god, I'm such a woman having to clean up after a man. Like, this is so problematic. Honestly, this game is so canceled. What is that? A film roll. A film? I guess what must have dropped fuck? it and knocked over the vase. Ew. I better throw that away. But there's writing on it. I want to see it. Mama, read it. Really? There's like writing on that. I'm sure the floor is spotless. Oh, this game is gonna be juicy, you guys. There's drama in this. Can I not read any of this? It won't let me read it. They could. Oh, that's right. Girls couldn't go to school, right? When, when were girls allowed in school? The suffrage movement was in like the '80s, right? I don't really remember. I think girls got in school in the '80s or something. Right. Now I just put the leaves back in the vase and it'll be like nothing ever happened. Oh. Okay. There, period. I'm gonna go put the mop back. 
2000 and no, I, I had I had a girl named Caitlin I in my class in kindergarten, and she kissed me without I my really consent, do, but and that turned me gay. That's not within my power. Because she was a bad kisser. Who knocked over that vase, Mr. Spade? Mr. Spade. Well, I can check with the airport and let you know when flights resume. Until then, I still don't have rights because of men like you. I'm actually a fascist. I support already. I mean, a feminist. I support women's rights. No, I'm not a fascist. Very unlikely. I don't know what that is. Don't, don't clip. Well, you're welcome to speak to my manager if you'd like. Oh. I'm sure he'll be thrilled to talk to Oh, you. I missed what she I said. I said the guest was a Mr. Spade. Oh, yeah, the okay. The film probably belongs to him. I, I need to give him back that fill on my thing. That little fill on. Talk to my manager's manager. Am I allowed to look to at this or am I going to get in trouble, mama? So... Which room are you staying in, You're Mr. so Spade? over. I'm not a fascist. I'm not a fascist. I don't know what a fascist is. I'm yes. serious. Yes. Okay, this is what I think a fascist is. So first I suggest finding Somebody who, like, owns a castle and, like, you know, right. has, like, a peasant. Clasp your hands is that a fascist or is that divine That's absolutism? Want the snowstorm to end. What's a fascist? Helps to repeat his name, too. More like a fat ass? G-O-D. Okay. I'm sure they'll be very <laughs> sympathetic to your plight. <laughs> you guys, I want you to know it's almost been 10 years since I've been in school. Seriously. Oh, so we're looking for Mr. Spade. No, Someone help me here. Serious. If anyone can make the snowstorm end, it's him. Spade! 505. Hello? 505. We got it. Oh, well. Where's the elevator? We're about the elevator. 505. I don't want to give him back this film, though. I'd rather just read it myself. Like, hello? Do I have to click something or something? A fascist is someone who has a strong opinion about someone else's fashion. Are you lying? Oh, I think I have to select it. I found it here, though. Speed. Room 505. Okay. Great. That's on my floor. I can return that phone roll without going out of my way. Walking past all the... Am I meant to clean these? Really? Why? Am I really supposed to? Like, she didn't... She, Beth didn't tell me to clean these. Like, am I really meant to? Is this female bitch simulator? Okay, whoa. Only I'm allowed to say that. Like, am I meant to do that? You're a maid? I'm a queen card, okay? I was an Enmix before I was a maid. But Ed makes flop so bad they all maids now. Hello! Hello! I'd like to go up in the elevator. Okay, am, am I lost? Hold on. I should go to the fifth floor to return Mr. Spade's film roll. Okay. Wait, hold Mr. on. Spade I, I want to look at this real quick. 505. So we know I'm Beth. Back. We, okay, Bernard's like the manager guy. Linda. Who's Linda? They were, oh no, he was saying Wendy's going to get fired. I don't... Okay, so she's the waitress at the hotel's manager. Jaqui. I don't think I know Jaqui just yet. Andrew is Ginger Snaps, and I don't think we know Bobby. I have a family. Mama and Pa. Okay. We don't know everyone yet, but we'll get there. I'm liking this game already. It's giving Jaqui realness. Jaqui ting. Like a little Jaqui ting. Uh, it's pronounced Jacka. Okay, Jacka. Hold it, please. Oh, Andrew, I'm so sorry for that. He is kind of caked up, Phew. though. Made it. Thanks. You're welcome. No, it's pronounced it Jock. Was the puddle by the restaurant? Now I know you're fucking lying. Was I not supposed to? Well, Eugene asked us not to touch anything until he's repaired the You loop. guys made me get a fucking Listen. bad ending! Someone slipped on it. Which floor? Oh, uh... Sixth. You should have left the door closed. Do that little bit of interactions affect the ending? Like if What's I the keep rush? a door, really? I That's how careful I have to be. Guest, the one who rented the entire. Yes. Place. Oh, is it that? What the fuck? Oh, now I miss what she said. Who is she talking about, Jaque? All the girls. Who is she talking about? I'm sorry. I'll pay attention. I just. You guys distract me with your big tits. Oh, the guy who knocked the big... Oh, Spade. Why does he need... Is it a oh, sort of very a basic question. Isn't very basic he? Question. He sure acts like one. I wouldn't want to be that poor assistant he keeps shouting at. I wish I was assigned to clean his room. Can you imagine the weird things I'd I find? spilled soda pop on me, you guys. What you wish for. 
wouldn't be surprised if the man kept a few skeletons in his closet. Can't you tell me who he is? I've never actually met him. I always talk to his assistant. Only Bernard knows his identity. Oh. Um. I do have a suspicion, though. Oh? But I'm, I'm not sure I should say it. Can't you at least give me a hint? She's gonna give us the tease. Okay, let me think. Ooh, saved by the bell. Hey, come on. Don't leave me hanging. Let's just say... I like to prolong the suspense. Wait. Why is he wearing eyeliner? <laughs> Damn little... <Nope. laughs> Fair enough. Coyla Ray would have ate if she played this role. She's so fucking nosy. Mind your business. Oh my god, it's Women's History Month. Hold I on, I'm having a thought. Mr. Spade's film role. I, I, I love how because I'm playing a... This game was made by a man. Whenever I'm having a thought, like, I have to really think hard to have a thought. Like, this game is like, okay, press the button, have a thought, female. Like, it's so hard for these females to have thoughts. Like, it's just so disrespectful, honestly. Anyway, here's our room. Why is the door open, though? Mr. Spade, that's so weird. Knock, mama! Mr. Spade? Mr. Spade? He? Oh my god, where the fuck is Mr. Spade? It's Roy. Oh my god, are there films in there? Oh fuck, we have to snoop the- The Archdiocese is in there. Oh my god, the Archdiocese. We have no chin, bitch. It's giving Kim Petras. I don't know. It's no chin on that face. <laughs> Why would you leave the door open? Maybe there was a draft or a ghost. <laughs> oh my god! Instagram! Pictures of me?! What the fuck?! Tampering with objects may lead to positive... Ooh, you know what? I'm not gonna touch. I'm not touching. Cause I can see all I need to see. I don't have to touch. I'm not touching. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Seriously. Mama, just leave! No, I'm not touching! I'm not touching! Mama, this is what I didn't want to do! Oh no, Mama, I did not want this. Clarington Hotel reception desk, Beth speaking. What can I do for you on this very fine day? Just go downstairs and tell her. I need Andrew's help, I need Beth. I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. Thank you so much, degradation. Beth or Andrew? Hi, I feel Ma, like I need a I woman's was intuition. An old God and you were talking about your anxiety. Are you doing better? Yes, Lots mama. of love, big nose. I had a bad year last year, but I'm having a good year this year. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I feel like we need a, a woman's intuition. Beth is a blabber mouth. Is she? I don't know, because that bellboy has a secret. And it's in his ass. It's a dildo. Like, I feel like I can trust Beth. Women are smarter than men, but they are sneakier. But men are more abusive. Like, honestly, here's how it's going to go, though. If Andrew's gay, I'm dead. If Andrew is gay, I get gay vibes. I get really gay vibes from Andrew. So, like, here's the thing. All men, all straight men want to hurt women unless they have a crush on that woman. So, like, if he doesn't have a crush on me, he's going to side with the other man and kill me. So I think we should go with Beth, because unless a man likes you, men either like you or they want to kill you. I mean, there's no in-between. So I think we should go with Beth, because she's either going to be, like, a shady girl, but she'll still be a girl. I'm, I'm going to go Beth. Beth, I'm going Beth, I need your help. Sophie? What's going on? We're going Beth. I, I think Mr. Spade's stalking me while I work. Really? I knew 
knew it. You did? I mean, I knew there was something fishy about him. He just has creep written all over his face, you know? How did you find out? He caught me snooping? I'm not gonna admit to that he on the phone, He took pictures honey. of me. I, <laughs> I found them hanging over the bathtub. And I'm still in his room saying all of this. Dark room. Pictures of you? No more snooping! Doing what? Having um, my pussy. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but... Sometimes, when I clean the rooms, I get a little curious. Did they I, record um, phones back in the 50s? You know, Who was there? I know at least one of you was. Through our guest stuff. Sneaky. And Mr. Spade caught you in the act, I suppose? No, yes, yes. they did. Oh, fuck. I think, I think we should call the police. No, that's a terrible idea. But Sophie, that, that is a terrible has idea. pictures of you running your hands through people's That is a terrible stuff. idea. But that's good advice. I didn't steal anything. I was just snooping. I I'm swear. with her. I know, I know, but... Say a client reports something missing, those pictures are with a her. target on your back. I could throw the pictures out. The thing is, if I th did you see how many films he had? That's probably all pictures of me. He probably has films on films on films. If I throw them out, then he's gonna know that I fucked with his shit and he has backup ammo. Like, I don't know. I really don't think I should. So, I just... Like, leave? I don't know if... I don't Do think it's nothing? a good idea. Do nothing? No. But it'd be smarter to wait until you have the whole story. Or at least more than you have now. Before making a move. I've been in dark rooms before. Setting one up in a space that isn't made for that takes time and effort. Wait. You're a photographer? I don't think the average girl has been in I a dark room. I was pictures a photographer took of me. Look, all I mean to say is there's no way he set all of this up just for a couple of pictures. There has to be more. There's a safe in here you want me to snoop? Well, I didn't look I don't want to keep room. snooping. I, like, I want to get out of this before I can, the killer's going to come. Do you have the safe combination then? I'm pretty sure it's locked. Mm, give me a minute. Ooh, she's gonna help us though. Oh, this is so salmon Sunday though. Merde. Those idiots. Merde. What? I can't find the combination merde. list. Oh, merde. Oh, merde. Probably lost it. Merde. Uh, anyway, we always ask that clients write down their code somewhere so they don't have to call reception a dozen times. You can have a look around the room, and I call you if Mr. Crane Okay, that's a good back. plan. That's a good plan. You know, so you can get out of there in time. Okay, Beth was the right choice. Thank you. Beth was the right oh, choice. Nothing. Oh, she can let Beth? a hoe know. Mm -hmm. Please keep this between us. Please, of course. Mama. I don't trust. The dark room thing was kind of shady, but she might have been a porn star. I feel like it's not that uncom. Make the bed. I don't want to touch, like, anything, though. What is that? Is that a beef jerkies? Or is it, like, a tail? Okay. What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Maybe he's just an investigator, though. You never know. Or a hitman. What the fuck is this? Montreal Tramway. The Statue of Liberty. I just went there for the first time. The Great God, Sistine. It, it's been years, hasn't it? The Great Lake of Michigan. You relate. The Beavers. I took mom skating there. Okay, wait. Two, 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 eight, quote, quote, two, eight, five, two, 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 five. Two eight five two 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 five. Two eight five two 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 five. I think that's cold. Why Harry's lots of wagon place clothes and the hotel? Harry's diner too. Nine six seven oh oh two two. This 
was the sale oh. where I found that winter jacket that Mom loves. Okay, okay. Are you there too? Okay. No combination, no entry. Why, Mama? I got a lot of clues there, I feel. I'd forget my own. Don't make right finger to down. buy me film. I guess we have that in common. This key. I should like close this door though, Mama, because someone's gonna see me doing something I'm gonna regret. Okay. Oh, his little pad's in there. Okay, his little pad is in there. Oh, and his little pad is. Wait, I can read that. I can read that. That's rough. Dear Mr. Morgan, I understand, and I'm one. sorry. No I need to spend so many years in the Los Badale. This doesn't change, and you're not really qualified. And if you hire someone, really, don't contact me, Jeremy. Okay, that's the same thing, but in cursive. Oh my god, you guys, I need to find this fucking code. This is not chartreuse, though. So this is him and some man. Infant, Dickinson, Belgium, November, 1344. So he's really old then. Okay. I'm not gonna make the bed, because then that's like really kind of like not good energy. Locked. There has to be a key somewhere. Is this the key? No, it's not. Fuck. Is this a key? A Neve? Oh my god, it's a Neve. Oh fuck, it's a Neve. What is this? He wear a blush? A cigarette? Oh my god. The clues uh, are everywhere. And the letter and the seven. Oh. Why did you want to He wants rooms? to change a room. He wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Lindsay's dish. Infertility diminish. L'Hospedale Discharge. Do not forget to take a mill. I'm not good at reading cursive. I'm just, is that a dildo? You guys, I can't find this code. I'm not, oh wait, 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 hold on, key, key, key. What do we have here? Yeah, 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 get that, get that, mama. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, he's gonna come back though, I'm scared. Hurry, mama, hurry. She's so fucking slow. His lover. Is that a girl or a boy? Danielle. Okay, it's a girl. You spent ten years in a psychiatric hospital. And it looks like you left This reads like the Dorothy Doll's days. diary. Anxiety and neurosis, can... character disorder, insomnia, memory loss. Nervous breakdowns, erratic behavior, shock treatment, insulin resistant. Oh, God. Oh, so he's a bit of a schizo. But there's no code in here. Like, that's not even genuine. Okay, put that key back, Mama. Can I put that back? Yeah, I don't need to keep that shit on me. That's a red flag. Wait, the garbage. No! Dear Mr. Mayo, you have to stop wilting at this address. Hearsay died two year ago. Do not know why happened within this two. Why you? But please let us. Grieve in peace. Thank you. Finsley's mother. Is this housekeeping ten to four? The Clarington? Room service night mostly. Lobby boys. Oh, he is gay. Okay. Space bar, what does that do? Oh, thank you so much. Oh my god. Edith Franklin, 34, Somersault, Burlington Coat Factory, Viagra, USA, Paul Elm. Okay, that was needed. Retall to the Lindsay. Mmm. 
So Lindsay is like not cool. No, I, I can't. Mama for real! We got the call. Figure out what's going on. Mama for real! I need to find some clues to decipher that code reminder. We know what the phone call means. What? No. Beth, you said you'd call if Mr. Spade was coming back to his room. Oh yeah, I did say that. Sorry for the fright. God, Beth, I nearly had a heart attack when I heard the phone ring. I didn't mean for it. I was just so caught up in the thrill of it all. I had to check in. Did you She's such a lesbian badge. Gay girl. I was about to open the safe. No, but I think I have enough leads to open the safe now. I'm impressed. Well done, Arsène Lupin. What? Oh, no. Arsene Lupin, we are. We are. Well, Arsene Lupin, 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 Arsene there's a code. 46, 42, 40, what is it? 46. No, I, I found it. I just can't remember. 24. 42. Got it. Damn it. 20, 35, 63. 20. 35, oh shit. 35. 20. Come on, Sophie. A cool, I need cold. It's cold. 54. Cold. Cold. Salmon Sunday. 39. Cold. Cold. What is it? 34. What is it? Nine, 99. 40. 44. 47. What is it? 50. 50. 50. Oh my god, it's cold. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold! There's a firearm here! Okay, let's see. M Saint H. Mm. Arriva Derci at the hall. Who are they? Arrive at the hall. Room and ready. Here? Waiting in the lobby. M and H both dressed nice. M has the flowers. What? And the receptionist saying, order oral? Picking flowers, oral. Room is ready. No M or H. You pack. No M and H. Making pictures. Can't sleep. Heard a word. M and H. 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 So many questions. I think he's following them. That's my thought process. Not to jump to conclusions. Okay, Sophie, you should probably put this down. No. We should throw the gun away, huh? Should we, you gay? Because he's gonna kill us. I'm gonna fuck something up. I'm gonna fuck something up. I already touched it. Fuck, I already touched it. We gotta get rid of it, mama. We have no choice. Throw it away. We already fucking touched it. I mean, my fingerprints are all over that shit. And this too. And you know what, this too. Oh my god. I didn't touch that one. It's fine. That didn't tell us shit, though. 
Okay, we know he's looking for M, but I'm not M and H. I'm not M and H. I should call reception. M and H could be in danger. Why don't we just go talk to fucking reception? I don't like this. Why would we do this? Like in the fucking room? Seriously? Throw this out. I did. I think. Did I? Clarington Hotel reception desk. Beth speaking. It's me. Oh, hold on. Andrew. Andrew, cover for me, will you? Andrew, you little gay bitch, you little little tinky tinky little George Washington boy hole muncher, little boy pussy Sorry George Washington wooden teeth boy so, hole boy pussy salmon Sunday. Mr. Spade. Well, Mr. Spade isn't even his real name. It's what? Lindsay. What is it then? Paul Lindsay Morgan. Ooh, I can see I knew that. I changed it. I knew that. So, did you open the safe? What was in it? Oh. <sighs> Do we trust Beth? Yay yeah, or nay? Yeah, you're name on the Beth on the Beth train, the toxic gossip train. I feel like she hasn't really given us a reason not to. I feel like the the comment about being in the dark room like Rachel Amber was weird, but she was just trying to be like a gal pal. Actually, I need your help again. Yes. I found out Mr. Morgan isn't only stalking me, but two other people as well. Oh, who are they? The yeah, and she's sapphic. I feel I like sapphic women I was hoping you could find are trustworthy. Well, Snoopy, although it may seem like it, I'm not Can you play class of 09? So it's on I'll stream. I'll send you the, the money to buy it, Do sad you know face. Can you play it for my birthday? Watch it's yesterday's vlog. I played it. I played it last night, you girl, you gay girl. They referred to as M and H. I found a transfer request. They're a couple. Okay, so we can reveal that we know what couple they're after. We can just say they're a couple, or we can not include that at all. Oh, I don't know what to do. We could reveal. I feel like the room transfer, isn't that a, like... I'm gonna go with option one, yeah. Mr. Morgan refers to them as H... And M. You well, think you just fell out of a coconut tree? Oh, good point. Good point. That cannot be their initials And I'm still either. here. It's been too long. I sweated you, my sweet yeah. schnookums. Yes, oh, Ria, there's something about you. Want. Magnetic. Mm. Charismatic. Sexy almost. But that's enough for me. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Mr. Morgan made a request to Look up an H&M in the, in the, in the book near 507. Denied because that's Mrs. Beaumont's room. Beaumont. Exactly. The bon 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 bon. Why change rooms when his entire the setup bon bon is in 505? I'm not sure. The bon I, I just bon thought bon it might be related. Maybe, but... The bon 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 hmm. Would you look at that? He's here. There's a couple staying in room 509. The bon Hector bon bon and Marcella Cruz. Hector and Marcella. H and M. Yeah, the bon that's bon what bon I'm bon thinking. Bon. Are they linked to me? What do we know about that? Do you know that? anything about the cruises? The bon well, bon I saw bon them bon. come in and out of the hotel a few times. The bon called bon a taxi bon for bon. them once. The missus does the smiling and the other frowns a lot. Nothing to write home about. Do you have room 509 on your to-do list by any chance? Add it. I do, actually. Then maybe you go clean it and have a little look-see? Yeah, nothing unusual. Here we go! Just a maid cleaning a room. That's the ball 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 ball. I'll call you if I find anything. Just Mercy. be careful, okay? I will. Mercy. I promise. In the high chap seat. Oh, bitch, we're giving, bitch. Yes, potato face. Gag it out, bitch. She's gonna be yours, though. I wanna cry at this game. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. The ball 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 ball. You think they're gay for each other lesbians? I must have forgotten my keys in the break room again. Oh, scheitza. Oh, sorry, you guys. Oh, my God. I toured in, I toured in Germany once, so I speak German on accident one day. What is this? Oh. Is this some kind of medication? Should I throw it out? Throw it out. Where, wait, what am I doing? <laughs> this is Sweden, Diefen, Dorfen, Doofen. This is everyone in Sweden. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Anyways, where's the break room now? 
Go to the room to clean. I don't have my keyness though. Big keyness, come find hmm. out. I think I have all this plasma. Oh, look at that. Wow. That means an angel has a dander problem. A little dander angel. Little dander. Little dander bitch. Little bitch with a dander issue. Little dander bitch girl. Yeah, let's, I'm let's sure put the towel I'll find there. more laundry to add okay. to the pile. You left one pill still and you leave room. What? Where's the break room? That's what I care about more. You leave pill bottle and you leave door open. Oh fuck, I did leave the door open. Shit. Oh fuck, I did. It, maybe the wind, the AC! Was central air invented? <laughs> was central air invented? Why is there a man's hat down here? Aren't maids like female? Oh, let's go through people's lockers. So this is Jaquie's locker. Oh, is that his little Jaquie girl? The way they look at each other. You can tell it's the real deal. That looks like Iggy Azalea. <laughs> is that Iggy Azalea? Bitch, that's literally Iggy Azalea. Did she escape the Malanga leaf and come here? Oh my god, throw it away. Artillery. It's locked. Oh, there's guns in that one. There's my key. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I don't know if I'm meek enough to take this. Hypo, right? What? Hypocrite bitch. Oh, hypocrite bitch. What did Linda do? And to whom? Who ha- Why? What is what? Linda, my wife will be at her parent tonight. So come to the house. And make sure you bring a new Lange. Oh, she cheated on her husband. Ooh. You know what? Let's do Linda a solid. No one needs to know about that. You know what? No one needs to know about that. That's her personal business, not the office's That'll business. Do. Okay, you know what? If she cheated, her man probably gave her a reason to. I know that's right. If she cheated, the man gave her a reason to. What is it? Wendy? Why is Wendy it's fucking Sophie. crying? Are you alright? Do I sound alright? I... No. Try hard, I bitch. guess not. Just leave me alone. I don't want to talk. Jaquie. Wait, Wendy, Wendy. Hold on my memory. <laughs> Wendy's the one who's getting fired. She... What's the lore? No, that was Linda. No, that was Wendy. Who was it? Help. Help. Help me. Help. Help me. Please, please, please help. Please, please. I need help right now. Please. I over... You know, let's just ask. I was in the break room earlier, and, um... I, I couldn't help but overhear your argument with Jacques. Oh, Jacques. I'm sorry he let Linda get to his head. He, he should be trusting you, not her. Yeah, well... I know I wouldn't be your first pick, but... I'm here if you need to talk. Maybe later. <laughs> what happened? I missed I it. Right now. I... I'm sorry I was rude. It's okay. Sophie? Yeah? Thank you. This game has really good voice acting now. I don't know what they were fighting about. I can't remember. I heard, no, what I heard was Mr. Bernard saying they're gonna fire Wendy, right? Hold on, how do I look at the characters again? Yes. Okay, hold on. Wendy's dating Jaquie, the bellboy. We haven't met him yet, I don't think. Or only in passing. Linda seems that Wendy is Clarington's resident flirt. Sure, she's popular with the guests and collects the most tips, but I was just observing the same thing as Jean to her and she has big tits. Linda's not convinced though and seems to have really taken her to expose Wendy for who she really is. Your best friend turns on you, your boss has made it her personal mission to get you fired, and your fidelity is nowhere to be found. Who could blame her for needing a good- okay. So, so Linda is exposing her as the cheater. Oh, wow, that's actually evil. 
But is she actually a cheater, though? <laughs> Linda's kind of a bitch. Linda is the governess. She rules over the maid and with a fisting problem. She has a soft spot for a fist. She is mean to Wendy, and she wants to break up Wendy and Jack. And she's worried that it succeeded. Linda is close with Bernard, but is known their relationship beyond co Oh. Bernard might be willing to bend over backwards for Linda, but firing the hotel software because she demands it. So Linda is trying to break up Wendy, this fat girl who's crying in the bathroom because she ate one too many muffins, with her man Jaquie, who we haven't met yet. And it's not really quite sure why Linda doesn't like her, but I'm sure we'll find out. And Bernard is the guy who's going to do the fireation. Linda's trying to manipulate Bernard into doing the fireation of Wendy, who allegedly cheated on her fiancé, Jaquie. But we're not, we don't know, did I get my key? Or did I forgot it? Did I get my key, mama? Yes, I did. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no, wait! Did Wendy put this on here? Erasing this yet? Then fuck! I mean, oh my god, my little brain, my little freaking brain checks again. No, no. Oh, now I get it. Oh god, now I get it. No, everything I just said was wrong. Linda, this is Linda's office. Linda has been trying to break up fat girl Wendy with her man, and this was Wendy's way of getting back at her. By exposing her for being a cheater herself. Oh, god damn it. Fuck, I, I would have let Wendy... I would have let Wendy get her lick back, because she deserves it. Fuck. God. Okay, but I'm kind of caught up with the lore now. I won't make more mistakes. Yeah, Linda's not exactly... God a, damn it. My door's always open. Restart? No, I, I made a mistake. It's my own fault. I'm not going to restart for that. Hey, you. Oh, hey. Gay hey. girl? On break already? Sadly, no. There's a I gay girl in the elevator? To, make to the sixth floor. Isn't that Jacques or Andrew's job? Well, they're both busy. There's a gay so, girl in the elevator? What about you? I thought you'd be in 509. I'm heading up now. I just had to grab Linda's master key before I could continue our investigation. Oh, Mama, be a little bit more low key, please. Well, this has been quite. The she's so over, not low key at all. I can't remember the last time work like, she's was not this interesting. Yeah, that's definitely one way to put it. That's not all, though. I'm AFK. One, two, three. Are you guys liking this game or are we hating it? What's the thought? Hating, meh, boring. Okay. It's okay. AFK, liking, it's alright. It's boring because it's not Roblox. I just saw something on Linda's door. I spoke to I was looking for my keys. And I heard someone crying in the bathroom. Well, I like it's it. It's the kind of game that I like. Someone hasn't broken it's fun into for yours. me. Who is it? It's Wendy. She's pretty upset. Oh, any idea what happened? I'm not completely sure, but I think it has something to do with the graffiti I found on Linda's door. The graffiti? What graffiti? It's two words in red lipstick. Hypocrite. Bitch. <laughs> well... Wendy would Wendy certainly from Red have Velvet. No, this Wendy's actually pretty. Like Linda's been treating her like her personal punching bag as of late. Oh my god. Wendy shouldn't have done that. Linda's too harsh. Linda is... I'm team... I think I'm team Wendy because I think you should not get involved in other people's relationships. You know, like... It's... it's 
Linda should, if she's picking on her for no reason, that's not cool. Like, that's not cool. Don't try and ruin somebody for something, something for somebody because you're just trying to be mean. Yeah, Linda's been pretty bad to Wendy. I'm not surprised I got me another cup of wine, snapped. you guys. Remember that day when Wendy came to work with that gorgeous perm? The staff, the clients, everyone complimented her. Then Linda this is came the 40s. along and She's sent her right back home to straighten it out because her cosmetic choices were distracting the clientele. Ugh. Her big laurels. I'm not trying to excuse her behavior, but <laughs> is that a measuring I think cup? Under a lot of no, it's a mug. It, it can't be easy managing so many people. Demi's favorite dish. Down your neck. You know, <laughs> I don't know how you do it, Sophie. Maybe it's because my empathy only goes so far, but... Guys, get a glass I of wine. We're relaxing I admire today. that you're able to feel for just about anyone. We could be a gay girl? One if we should, two if we shouldn't, three if you have a little forehead disorder. <laughs> Pick. Gay girl. I like to put myself in other people's shoes, especially if there are people I find fascinating. The ball. Like you. Sam and Sunday. Wow. The way you turn that compliment right Sam back and Sunday, though. It's giving Sam and Sunday. Masterful. <laughs> well, this was a lovely chat, but I She totally turned us down. Hopefully, he can help me find this. She's not a gay girl. Back in the day, team. bitches with short hair like cop. Yeah, bitches with long hair were gay girls. Today. I can't wait to find out more about our friends H and M. Take care. You too. She's closeted. Maybe closeted trans, but not closeted lesbian. <laughs> I'm a zero Thank IQ so three year old baddie. Mama, you will not regret that. You're fucked. <laughs> Five dollars into my loan for VIP mama. Can you explain the law to me? Because I wasn't here. Thank you, Uni. I so appreciate it so much. She's like weird, but like she's us. So like, ooh, but like, okay. And like, we notice a picture and we're like, what is this picture of us? So like, let's find out. And now we are trying to find out how fake gay girls act when a real gay bitch comes in. <laughs> you gay girls are so funny with your little soccer games and all that. Okay, let's go to 509, 507, 509, periods. <laughs> oh, this is like an economy room, huh? This one's not that cute. So this is the room of the couple. More work for poor Rebecca. And they were getting Hang some there, cleaning done of their clothing. Okay, I'm not actually gonna clean though, because like, why would I? That's like so stupid. Like, I don't. I'm not actually cleaning now. Like, I won't be cleaning. I just won't leave any evidence that I was here. I'll hold off on throwing mm. this out just yet. Mm. The food's practically so untouched. Good. Why is there no bed in this fucking room? Where's the bed? Oh, is, is, is that a bibble? Oh, fuck. So this... Who, 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 whoever is sleeping on the couch is um, very easily... Very gullible. Very gullible person who's ever sleeping on this couch. You have to clean. It's on your list of room to clean. Wow. You look oh, like a couple out hot. of a magazine. January 14th. Oh my god. They've been together for many a year. Okay, fine. I'll fucking clean. What what needs to be cleaned? It looks like someone Clean. Clean something. Clean. 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 Let me clean this Nini off this little TT, little tub tub, little. The Leon. Leon. Let me do some cleaning, I guess. Did I get it all? Huh? 
Uh, and I'm cleaning the tub, bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to buy a fucking sub, bitch. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm gonna fucking fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little fucking duck. Yeah, yeah. Did I get it all though? Why is she not saying it's clean? Like, why is she- usually she's like, oh, ha, ha. I'm gonna guess it's clean, even though she's not saying that it's clean. Which is kind of like bad energy from her. Okay. There's some little scat flakes on here. A little scat. A little scatty boo. <laughs> the worst error you guys had is when you guys were calling me scatty boo, because I told you guys that I sharded myself. That was so mean, you guys. Because we've all sharded ourselves. Everyone here, just know that the person above you and the person below you has sharded themselves. At least twice. Everyone. Grocery store has, head barb has, Bezosi has, Gorgy Girl, Evelyn Rose, Bliver, Nat, Jamila. You have had a little a little brown stain in your little pant. From your little tutu. <laughs> This person looking back in Texas. I'm sorry, if somebody wrote me a letter like this, it's not getting read. Cause what is this even? This looks like hieroglyphics, honey. I cannot believe you went to Montreal with your wife. Luciana has five fucking girls and she's pregnant with another girl. Juan is on the corner of Rome and they're married with a family. I drove to your house. I left. I met a man. He's a worker. I you think know. you just fell out of a coconut Why did tree? You come there? It's your <laughs> uncle's party. Your cake. Your mother. Thank oh. you so much, Ami. Oh my god, Ami! How's your little fake ginger hair, bitch? Yeah, exactly. You're so gagged, though. Just ate you up. Oh, a cross. So he's very gullible. He's very gullible. Someone's been sleeping here. I should leave it as it is. I think they're having some problems with their relationship, honestly. That's what it's giving me anyway. 19 arrested in the Deviat ride. Oh God. Stop worrying and save your mar marriage with lice oil. Lice oil is a science. Oh my God. You can clean the garbage cans more. Looks like someone tore that note apart. I'm missing some pieces. Oh, fuck. I can't you make out what's Mama written. Moo. Mama Moo, you spilled Mama Moo. Mama Moo, you spilled Mama Moo. Mama Moo, you Mama Moo. I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. Thank you so much, Mama Moo. I really appreciate that, Mama Moo. I won't lie, I have gotten a bit scatty with the Jamaican food I've been eating and MAAA Ma. Also, I'm to blame for the scatty boo nickname, but I'm not sorry, Zoxo. Zoxo, bitch. Salmon Sunday. I don't give a fuck. Scatty boo the house. I don't give a fuck. It's getting scatty boo. Because I have scattered. On the wall, in the toilet, on the freezer. Mrs. Cruz got her Ernie, information Ernie, we apologize on behalf of our company in the Mark privacy breach that occurred on the 25th of the November, September, and calling it. So someone's privacy was erupted like a volcano. Locked. It looks like the code is made up of okay. four letters. Four letters. Y M C M B. Yeah. A little panty liner. Ooh. Oh fuck! There's a little drink in there. She's been. N T. Fuck. So they're having this a fight about some. This couple is fighting Maybe about like have their one. like future as a relationship. I think. I think in terms of like having a baby or something of that nature. Like, whoa. Let's let's take some jewelry though and sell it though. Can close that. We don't want to be seen snooping through that, honey. That's not good. Oh fuck. Mama, I wasn't done snooping. Am I gonna get more time? I'm back. Why are you a maid? Because I'm a female. Oh no. Hmm. Ooh. So this is like a poozle. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do this based off of longitude and latitude. So this one goes here, but this 
Um, okay, this is a corner, but it's this corner. And this, the bad guy Chun-Li. Oh, 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 oh. Like that, and then I'm gonna calculate the diameter of the third reign of King George the 42nd ancestor, Kayla Sims. I'm gonna use the regional circumference of my nose divided by Lizzo's belt size and discover that this goes here. And then I'm gonna discover something crazy that this goes here while simultaneously announcing my engagement on YouTube Shorts by placing this here. And then I'll be like Tom Daly's booty pick and get leaked on Tumblr by assuming the representation of this going there. I need help. I don't know what to do. <laughs> you guys have all seen Tom Daly's booty pit. Come on. I'm so confused. Yeah, me too. I need help. <laughs> Looks like your nose. What, this big triangle? Okay, mama, we get it. I have a big nose and a little sassy attitude, but that's not a reason to be rude. Like, come on now, hon. Hon, <laughs> did you guys see that? <laughs> have you guys seen this? Hold on. <laughs> Han. <laughs> and she spelled it wrong. <laughs> Han. <laughs> okay. I need help. <laughs> Those two on the bottom are upside down. I knew it. That's what I was thinking. Oh, I knew it. That's what I was thinking as well. <laughs> Which two, Ma? <laughs> okay, I gotta put the wine down. I'm getting giggly. <laughs> very bottom one. Oh, so you're saying what I thought you were in a weird way. Okay, mama. No. <gasps> oh, okay. So it's, no. It's being, it's hot dog style. See, I thought it was hamburger style, but it's hot dog style on the paper. My bad. I just assumed it, it, would, it would be hamburger style, but it's hot dog style. My bad. I just didn't even assume that, honestly, you guys. <laughs> Don't act like that's not how you guys learned how to which way the paper was going. We all know, like, this is hot dog style. You know, like, going this way. Not hamburger going this way. Period. Eat the... It's... Maclemore and Ryan Lewis. Could I break it? Is that French or Egyptian? Hmm. <laughs> People can call me stupid, but they can never call me. Norwegian. Because I'm not. I need to clean as a woman should. A lot of beauty products. She's not a naturally beautiful woman. She's very fake and uses a lot of makeup and stuff. 
Okay, where's her other pillow? Oh, I'm gonna leave her other pillow there. <laughs> so what's the code, you guys? It looks like the code is made up of four letters. Okay, so... I should keep an eye out for those symbols. Mm. I was considering that as well. So we... Is there a way that I can look at that thing that I just... Oh, it's here. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. 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 So I'm in Russia right now, and like there's a crazy American like sayer, and he's saying like bad things about like codes. And I'm like, okay, let me decode this and give a message to my good Judy Putin, but secretly. So let's do it. Four. One, two, three, four. A. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. H. Four. Music no. R. No, no. What word? Four is I? Oh, oh. One, two, three, four. Oh, oh. I? I kill, I kill. I kill Luna. Check clues around the room. Okay, yeah, you ate that. Wait, no, we knew, we knew, we knew, we knew. We knew one thing. We knew one thing. We knew one thing. N T. G P N T G P N T G P N T G P N T I Okay. Okay, we're getting somewhere with it at least. You gave people my phone. Well, I want to look on that side. Nada. Sugar. Okay. S? Wait, I know it. 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 You need to interact with the hints on the letters and the paper. I will. Don't you worry. That's not relevant to this proceeding. But this may be. It's not relevant. Hey, that's what that guy had hanging up in his little room. Under the new room. It's not relevant. It's not relevant. Ah. Uh. These pearls, they look absolutely gorgeous on you. Ah. Uh. Oh, I bet you can make anything look good. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. I think it's not relevant, you guys. Seriously, I'm getting not relevant vibes. Am I off the mark with that? So 
someone's been sleeping here. I just feel like it's not I relevant. Yes, it is. Okay, I know it. Okay, so let me think here. So with what I saw in the lights saw out in the newspaper. Okay, hold on. I'm just trying to look up what this symbol is called, because I know I saw that on the lights up. What is this symbol called? What is that called? Oh god, I don't know if I can figure this out. Okay, so we know that she wore pearls. That is something that we do know. So with the pearl necklace and the dinosaur toes. Okay, hold on. Mm. Okay. Give me a second here. I'm just trying to figure this out. I have a notepad pulled up here. Okay. A squiggle. A squiggle. So we had the pearls, the Lysol. What else did we have? Okay. Oh, I see. I see. Hmm. Okay, so with the pearls, the Lysol, the dragon's breath, I'm missing one thing, though. What is that one thing? Oh, cruise! Okay, I got it. I'm waiting for my sources to get back to me. I will leave notes in the vent next to your room. Oh my god. Oh, sorry, my sources came through. My sources. I, no, I was talking to my sources. My, it was my manager, my Twitch manager. My sources. I'm not cheating! It's my sources! Hey, Beth. It's me. Hey, so how did this new thing go? I did. I found a message written in strange symbols. A kind of secret code. A secret code? Well, spill the beans. What did it say? I will leave notes in the vent next to your room. In the vent? Who the hell does that? How long does game 11? Know, but whoever We're the not message gonna beat was it tonight. intended for went through Should a we go lot watch of trouble our to show hide soon? It. it was torn in a dozen pieces and scattered in three different trash cans. Mm. So the cruises are keeping secrets from each other. Do you think one of them's having an affair? <laughs> you think you just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> I got water on me. Wee, 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 wee. Yo, when did Nick start PLAYIN this? I had How much today. did I miss? Uh, you missed about an hour. I'm not that far in. I don't think it's an affair. I do think it's blackmail. Although the couple is fighting, clearly the man that's sleeping on the couch, um, I don't think it's an affair. I don't. I think it's blackmail because they're not going to be getting stalked over an affair. Unless maybe the wife hired a PI or something, but I don't know. I don't, I don't know. think it's that. It really looks like blackmail. It looks like blackmail to me. What makes you say that? Like, would you go through all this trouble about over that? I need to check um, that out. Before we delve into theories, I think I'd better go have a look at the vent that's meant to change. The I'm covered in water. Yeah, good idea, Bean. 
I'm what did you call me? Break, so if you need my help again, just ask Andrew to patch Where the pearl necklace room. that Nick's talking about right. has no correlation with the puzzle? Oh, I will. Yeah, I'm sure you're really good at puzzles because you hyper focus on things with that little ADHD disease you have. Her little bean, like little lesbian, like little bean flick, little um, like pussy flick, like clitoris touching. God, a little click got touched. Okay, I'm gonna check this vent though. Do you guys think it's an affair? Don't tell me if you already know. Cause that guy is stalking this couple. Spade is stalking this couple, but I don't think it's an affair. I like she could just want space from him. Unrelated. What did this say again? Hold on. No, see, there was a security breach, and this says SOS on it. Like, are you kidding me? I don't think it's an affair. The message said. Oh, next to your one. room. You can check it anyway so just to be sure. It has but to be a vent in the corridor. I don't think it's cheating. I think it's something more sinister than that. Which vent though? There's no vent. Among us? Among us chungus? <laughs> okay, here we go. Big penis disorder? Can't open these without a screwdriver. Oh fuck, the closet's right here though. Okay, where's a screwy? I need a screwy so bad. I need a screwy. Oh, tea, there's tea. There's tea here, there's tea here. Okay, that's first. This must go here. That one's there, this one's here. Wait, we don't have all the pieces though you gave people on my phone. Wait, maybe we do. No, we do. Okay, I ate that. Wooing. Bermuda huh? talks to them in the scroll draft. Probably working in Bernard's oh. office right now. Bernard tells me there's a cold dog coming from his window in his office. I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. Fixing this should be the highest priority. Will you be playing Class of 09 again? Please do and try to get another ending. Hmm. What's life without a little challenge? Okay, but we know where it is. The screwdriver... Bernardi told me there's a... Okay, Bernard, Bernard's office. We have to go to Bernard's office. The screwy must be in there. No? Is it not? Is my dedution there not good? Is my dedution not good? I think that the douche was pretty good. That that the douche was like, right? The the douche. Ooh. Butterface in the in the ele elevator. <clears throat> it's uh, Miss Bellavet, isn't it? What? You don't know my oh, name? Uh, How long have I fucking worked here? Uh, Big nose bitch. He's built like a fridge, straight up. You're the one who took last week off, aren't you? you my to, mom uh, has cancer. Take care of your my sister, sister has COVID. Mother. My dad has my shingles. Mother. She's, um, she's very sick. Hmm. No, I hope this doesn't become a recurring thing. I need to know I can count on you. I understand, sir. What are you doing here anyway? Are you on break? I'm in the fucking elevator! The blank icon indicates a lie. Lies make it a tough spot, but you're gonna get caught in a lie. No, I don't think, should we lie? I mean, why would we need to lie? Like, we need a screwdriver. Like, we need to fix something in one of the rooms. Is that weird for a maid? Would a maid not do that? Just lie? Yes. I am. Hmm. Don't take too long. No, no, no. I won't. <clears throat> we're like an irrelevant nobody to him. I feel like he's not going to care if we're telling the truth or not, right? Like, he won't double check. Well, don't you look oh. mischievous. <laughs> hey, Bean. Mischievous? If you're planning to give Bernard a good scare, sign me up. No, I'm looking for a screwdriver for the vent. Linda asked Eugene to fix Bernard's window. Oh, I see. 
Eugene? Oh my god, it's what raining. It's gay. It's you gay girl. Go and take a look. I'll stand guard by the elevator and make some noise if I see Bernard coming. Okay, thanks. I'll be quick. Oh my god, what the fuck? Did he commit a sewer? Oh my god, I think there's a dead little fucker out there. A little dead fuck thing. My pussy puddle. Posing something that could help so Dear much. Mr. Wet, oh, I would like to thank in the partnership and the clearing and the wet and the store ridiculous. and the help and the renovation and looking better and a no and attention and construction of mental hospital and the students and the cuckoo choo cuckoo cabaro. I don't gotta. Anyways, uh -huh. anyways. Let's get you to that vent. But this blizzard. Bernard's office will be a skating rink by the end of Hold the on, day. Hold on, I want to snoop though. Best this does I want to thank a brother like a for a new agreement and a jail. I had no idea things Keep to your side in the bargain and stay out of my way. I worked relentlessly at the return and the clearing and the glory and the great challenge and the considering and the state and you went and you're dead. And I asked for the lower prices and the plan is the opposite. My guess will be a crim de la crim and the crim de la deviance. Oh, so he's a shady businessman. He's a shady businessman. He's trying to raise prices on the hodl. Okay, Mr. Bernard, I see. He's a shady businessman. Clearly your break is over by now. No, it's not. I came by here not too long ago, and Andrew was already covering for you. That's because I was in the ladies' room. That's no excuse to- It's my time of the month. I- uh... You're married, aren't you? So, you know how it is. I have to go more often, and... Oh, sometimes I stain the furniture, and, and don't get me started on all Her the... Her pussy makes a red paint? Details. I... Miss Bellevin, what were you doing in my office? Oh, fuck. Do we lie? We have to lie. Cause bitch, we should have told the fucking truth earlier. I wasn't, I was, I was simply closing the door. Someone left it ajar. Really? But that doesn't explain what you're doing on this floor. You know very well the cleaning staff isn't supposed to wander around the lobby for no reason. I... You wouldn't be lying to me, would you, Miss Belovit? No, no, I swear, I... It's my fault. I asked her to come clean up a mess I made. Spilled coffee. Coffee? Oh, Miss Lambert. Thank God for Beth. No, Beth was the right choice as a sidekick. Seriously. Yeah, well, there are so many rules. Thank here. God. She was the right choice for a sidekick. Come with me. But, but, but wait, I cleaned his office. Oh, no. And I closed the window. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, no. Sorry. That's the queen. She doesn't give a fuck. We should have just said that we run away. Just go, just go. Go to the vent. Go to the fucking vent. This game apparently has triggering content in it, so I guess I want. I feel like the story is kind of heating up, and I should warn about that now. Allegedly, this game has like triggering content in it. I don't know if it's gonna be suicide or what, but. Just be wary. I don't know when it's gonna pop up. I'm assuming out of nowhere, so. Big nose? Yeah, and I'll breathe in your little booty breath. That's why I can't meet you. Because I'm gonna smell your little booty breath. My big nose can smell your little booty breath. Hun. I'll say it. Bitch, let me close this. <laughs> 10 years later, this game has nine different types of trigger warnings. Oh my god. Okay, girls who are easily I'm manipulated. I disturb room 508 now. But Hold on, mama. That's where Bernard and Linda work. I want to get in this vent first. Since you've been like this. Ah, no screw for me. Oh. 
Secret message. It's cool. It's giving cool the cool. <sighs> My sources, <laughs> guys. Hold on. I have sources. Hold on. I'm gonna. I'm gonna make like, a quick phone call. I'm gonna mute. I'm gonna mute. Guys, that was Chelsea lately, and I ha um, she got back to me, so thank God for that. Otherwise, we'd be in a world of trouble, you guys. We'd be in a world. I. G. H. Y. Room. S. L. I. P. Will. 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 A. A. C, B, B, we need to scissor tonight. We need to scissor. Meet me tonight in my room. Oh Michael my will God. be sleeping. We need to discuss our plan. So the girl who's getting stalked is actually doing something shady to her husband. It's not the man, it's the woman. Clarington Hotel reception desk, Beth speaking. It's me. Oh, hello Bean. Anything new to report? Did I get you in trouble earlier? Yeah, but I also wanted to thank you for saving my skin earlier. Oh, you're welcome. I hope I didn't get you into too much trouble. Well, I thought I was in for another one of Bernard's sermons, but it didn't happen. Oh? I'm not sure what it was, but he found some piece of paper that completely distracted him. He ended up asking me to type letters for him. <laughs> as if I was a secretary. Is that my fault? It's better than a sermon, but... It's Is that because I did shit in his office? I do oh, have no. sore fingers now. So tell me it was worth it. Tell me you found something good in that vent. Yes, I did. I found another message written in secret code. What does it say? Meet me tonight in my room. Michael will be sleeping. We need to discuss our plan. Michael? Who's that? Another husband? I don't know. It's the first time I'm hearing of a Michael in this story. H&M, isn't it Michael? Let me check the logbook. There's a Michael staying in room 507. Mrs. Beaumont's room? But she doesn't have a husband. She's here alone with... Oh, Michael must be her son. I got him some extra blankets the other day so he could build a fort. Oh no, it's Marcella. Yes. Uh, no, never mind. <laughs> so, what's next? I guess I should go have a look at 507. Oh. It's not on my list. Work knife gamer. There's a do not disturb sign on the door. Okay, so it could be the well, man. I could call the room to make sure no one's there. Good idea. Hang on. The all clear bean. Head on over. Thanks, Why Beth. is she doing all I'll this? Call you back. Pretty much the lore, if you're just joining in, I'll probably watch HOV honestly now, but the lore, in case you don't know what's going on, um, we went to clean some guy's room and he had pictures of us. He was taking pictures of us and he had them all, and we're just a low timely maid. Okay? We're a low timely maid, a, a, like a, a female. So, like, we don't have much... This is the 1901. And so, we started doing some digging, and he's stalking this couple called H&M. H&M. So, now we're in their room. What were their names again? It was Marce It was Henry and Marcella? Mrs. Cruz. See how this is addressed to her, though? And this is not addressed to him? This must be to Marcella. 
So I feel like she's the one who's in trouble, not him. I mean, I'm sure he might be involved and they're like fighting about it, but maybe they're not and that's why she makes him sleep out here. I'm not sure. I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. I'm not sure, but I feel like it's her who's in the hot seat because why is he out on the couch? Clocking but in maybe... late, where's my streaming perms, you liar? Ooh. It's like a murder mystery game, so we don't really know what's Locked. going on yet. Fuck, I need it to do that still, like too. It looks like the code is made up of four letters. Okay, I think we're going to wrap up this segment here, though, and we're going to watch HOV now, House of Villains. But I'm liking this game. I don't... I'm going to keep playing it. I'm going to keep streaming this game. I'm liking it. I'm curious to see where it's going to go. We don't know too... I think I'm still kind of in the intro section, probably. I don't really know too much yet. But anyways, the lore is, we found some... We're Sophie. We found some guy saying that was taking pictures of us, spying on us, and getting them printed out as if he's going to show them to somebody. We found out he's stalking somebody, and that we want to know what his business is with this couple, because that might help us figure out I'm a zero, I'm why a he's stalking daddy. us. Why he's stalking us. Looks like I'm headed to room 507. We were headed to room 507. Um, and we had just recently discovered that... <laughs> That's enough gaming for the day. Hi, Tomo. How was your Thanksgiving? Okay, let me get into the, let me get into the, the mindset. Okay, so we were investigating. We had found that we were being stalked. And then we found out our stalker was also stalking somebody else. So now we're going to stalk him and the people that he's stalking to figure out why we're being stalked. So what we know right now is he's stalking a couple as well as me, and we want to know who this couple is that he is stalking so that um, we can find out why he's stalking them, and that will maybe help us find out why he's stalking you us. You think you just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> Mommy, your nose looks bigger than usual. I'm doing fabulously, and my nose is looking fabulous. Mommy, your nose oh, that's right, but I, usual. but I okay? still can't get in this. It looks like the code is made up of... So, this, so my theory was... Oh, my big ham legs got in the way. My theory was that the husband and wife were having issues. You know how the man always sleeps on the couch when there's a fight because women are superior to men, according to many? Um, she's the one that had, like, the document here regarding, like... What was this again? Oh, there was a pro there, there, there was a, a breach of privacy. So they were having like some issues, and I assume the man was out here. So I don't know if he's being stalked, if he's correlated, or it's just the woman, or it's just the woman. Did did I save after I looked in the vent? I don't remember what was in there. Five oh seven. Who's? I should have just beat this game in one night because honestly, I can't really remember whatever is going on. I love how we walk like we have a little dragon toy in. Just so tweely and so meekly. It's just so meek and so twee and so cute. Watch your VOD. Oh no, never. Oh my god. I don't remember whose room this is. Bitch, it said do not disturb. That means they're inside. Are you serious? Can you guys hear the game? It's kind of low for me. Can you guys hear it? I'm going to turn it up. No. Okay, I turned it off. Oh my god. Oh, that's right! There was a lady staying in here with her son, but the son had to go to the great school. So, the son is not here. No, she's not gonna get fired. I think her manager is- her, her manager, Beth, is like helping her do a stock. Funny how some games really stand the test of time. Okay. I used to play this with mom all the time. Oh, shoots and ladders. I didn't like shoots and ladders because I've fallen down lots of times and it was kind of triggersome for me. Like whenever I fell off a changing table or when I rolled down a driveway as a baby. Locked. Oh, the fuck. Key There's some has keys. to be around here somewhere. What I'm doing some stalking. She puts a collar on her son. Oh my god. Her son's name is Greta. Russian. Oh my god, we don't have to call right now. So husband Dear Annie, I met with the Lois and I gave you a letter and I reiterate and, and there's like accusation of wife abuse? Ugh. Are no grounds for divorcee in Quebec? I understand you are hurting and antagonizing your husband is very wise. Don't forget the court. Oh. 
So she's here in this hotel with her son because her husband hit the fuck out of her with like a bat, I'm sure. But I'm guessing she can't get a divorce over that. When did divorce become legal? I'm gonna close that so nobody suspects me. Oh, but outright threatening you. I met with your oh, damn lawyer. You, you have some balls. You're irreproachable. Do you know where I don't know? Worst of all is that you won't let me see my son. I don't know you. I think you have a chance to get custody. You don't know me. I will only take Michael away from you. Okay, so Michael is the son. Michael is the son. I don't know. Like, I think it's... This might be a hot take. And I know it's very different for all couples and, like, people. But I think it's perfectly fine for a woman to keep her son away from her husband. Because, like, if he's, like, hitting the wife, then that means he has aggression problems and probably isn't suited to be a parent. Like, maybe supervised he can see his son, but not in general. Okay, that's clean. I'm gonna throw his little fucking toy away. Fuck you, Michael. <laughs> you have no dad and no toy, bitch. Your life's over. Oh, she's a smoker, though. Mm, maybe she should lose her kid. The White Cat Bar and Restaurant in the Metcalf in the Montreal. Mmm. Okay, we should clean this mirror. Oh, there's gonna be a code in this mirror. Never mind. There is not going to be a code. Is that Scatty Boo? There's Scatty Boo on this fucking mirror. Oh my god, a little Scatty Boo. I can't tell what's dirty on my monitor and where this is dirty. <laughs> Gag the planet. <laughs> Honestly, I'm for global warming because I'm sick of this life. <laughs> okay, let's snoop more. <laughs> Why is it so foggy? Maybe she likes it really hot and spicy. <gasps> oh, thought it was a murder. Oh, the red lion. Rich tobacco taste. Cigarettes are so disgusting. Like, I could never. I could honestly never be a smoker. Like, cigarettes are so vile to me. Mr. Cruz, Cruz. Huh? Wait, we know this name. We know this name. Cruz, Cruz. Can someone help jog my memory? Is this the guy who sleeps in the room with his wife? But the wife, like, hate and he sleep on a couch? M and H. Okay, yeah, so, yes. Hector Cruz. This is the guy who's sleeping on the couch in the other room. So they're connected. Numbers, dates, times. 1824. What does it all mean? 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. Oh, yeah. Open that bitch up. The Royals. Oh, my God. There's a woman. You almost look like Marcella. Marcella and Hector Cruz, the couple from the other room, they're lawyers. They're the lawyers of this girl's wife abuse case, and there was a data breach. Ah, oh, TV! Yay! I love watching my new TV for me. Oh my god. And and Michael hasn't been at school, and your son has no longer going to school. You will get bu oh, she's gonna homeschool him. Well, he's gonna grow up to be just like Millie Bobby Brown. Very weird, and say a lot of weird stuff. Poor kid, honestly. Oh, Michael. Dad, I asked mom to tell you the name, confusing. not to tell you. She allowed me to talk about our room. We have beds and TVs and a forts, and the hotel is nice, and I miss my mom. And I wish I could go see my dad. She says she doesn't love you. Will she stop loving me? Mind your fucking business. So I am an asparagus. We are on a train for two I days. didn't want anyone noticing. And I am on Valentine's Day. When you arrive talking to me. Oh. What does this mean? She's cheating on her husband? We're on the train. What does this mean? Affair. Oh my god. Mama, let's research. Code red! We have a code red in the nuclear lab! I don't get it. I honestly don't get it. Like, I'm gonna be honest. This game's kind of a little too hard for me, but I'll get there in the end when I watch an explanation video. Oh, the kid wants to kill his own mother with these. 
They're super sharp like a needle. Or the little boy's doing heroin and using that as the needle. The plot has thickened. Do you, do you think he's gay and that's why the mom is like taking him out of school? Because that's like young Miami said, she would beat her kid if he was gay. Maybe this mom is scared that he's gonna get beat for being gay. Like a little green needle. What's inside of this frame? Who brings a picture to a hotel? Are you weird? What's this here? 1824. 1824. 1824. Oh my god, I just don't even know where to look for my research. Oh, it was a limerick. It was a limerick, yep. Mm hmm This is a little limerick. Is this a limerick? Limerick? Is this a limerick? <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, oh she's on the, um, the, the bleeding pussy. Looks like someone grew tired of looking at your face, Mr. Beaumont. Oh, she kind of has a wobbly face, though. Very lopsided. Or does she have a black eye because her husband socked it to her? Oh, I don't know. I really can't tell, honestly. That kid is malnourished, though. He needs to eat, though. He looks Anna. And that dog doesn't look too healthy, either. Is that a Doberman? Botched or abused? A dog is a human? A human dog? I should bring that back to my cart. Yeah, I should, honestly. Well, there was no information in here. Like, I am not any closer to finding the truth. Like, is it just me or was all that information really useless? Does carrying this everywhere really make us better maids? I'm not reading that no, shit. I can do my so. job all on my own. We have to do 505. Okay, we did 508. We have to go back to 505. Apparently we have unfinished business there. Close the damn door. I'm cleaning. They can fucking... Be. It's not suspicious to see a maid cleaning. Like, how is that even suspicious? Have oh, I... boy. Someone's been living it up. Am I meant to be in this room? Oh, there was an orgy in here. It was probably Frankie Grandy and his little things. Caution, wet floor. Oh, my God. This place is a mess. Oh my god, who could do such a thing? Oh, this is so rude. This is just so rude. Get this shit out of here, though. Oh my god, and the light went upside down and started floating. All that's missing are the pillows. Oh my god. Why is there only two pillows? Grandy? Nick's apartment tour? You guys have seen my apartment, and you actually said it's quite cute. Frankie Grandy and Spongebob. Honestly, I don't even think Ariana's new man is ugly. I think he's he's good for her. She needs someone like that. Like all tofu looking. Everyone else is an abuser. The people who are like a little off looking, they're not abusive because they were probably abused. Do you know what I'm saying? Like she needs her a little ugly thing. <gasps> Blood. That's too long, I'm not reading that. I'm sorry, I just can't deal with that. The breakfast menu like why can't i go into all these safes okay this looks clean enough honestly like oh really you guys honestly i would love to be a maid working at a hotel is one of my okay these are my 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 dream jobs hotel person dental assistant pet smart cashier those are like three great jobs i Could feel the shoe from the chocolate fountain Oh, that's I right. Wait tell Andrew. The little ginger snap. Sorry for the mess. Oh, freak you, lady. This is just more freaking mess, lady. It could be a drag queen as well. You never know at these times who's wearing lipstick. You never know. Okay, that looks pretty good. I think we're good here. Is this clean? This is giving clean. Okay, let me do this. This is giving me clean vibes, like very, oh, what's this? Not exactly a cherished gift. I um, I love you, Lyanne, and I love you, and I love you. Good, that's always nice. Throw it away. They shouldn't be leaving it out. It's just creating more mess, honestly. 
I guess we're done here. There really isn't shit in this room, but I guess I got it clean, so that's all I needed to do. Bye, forever, never coming back. Okay, so what are I- the drill, Sophie. Let's sweep and snoop. What have I not found? Like, hello? I swear there's nothing left in here for me. Is someone in the shower? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, mama, we gotta hide, though. Mama. Go in. No, they're gonna fucking catch me, mama. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's right. I left the water on. Okay, never mind. No, never mind. I ha wait, 1824. 1824. 1824. 1824. Locked. It looks oh, like the code is made up of numbers aren't letters. letters, I don't think. Nail polish. Is she slutty? Okay. 1824. What are four letters that like occur for a code? <laughs> Here we go. I correct the code. Um, what room am I going for? Oh. Oh, wow. Oh my god. A little bit of a scandalous happening here. Someone got their pussy touched and tasted last night. Mmm, I bet it tasted good too. What a lucky guy. <gasps> a bleed?! Not my issue. A bullet. Oh my god. Bitch! Randy, I don't know if you talk to guests. And they say, sweetie, in the coffee cups. And I'm doing a tip for the month of rewards. And I'm a problem with your behavior. You're a guest. But you're not engaging. And I'm not silent. Jaquie saw you? He's ashamed. Maybe you Bernard fooled like every other man. But you're a bitch. Who is Linda again? So somebody caught somebody being too friendly with the patients. But... It's not my drama. All the way. Keep the place nice and clean, you know. Let me check the bathroom. There better be a big shit in the total scatty boo. No scatty boo. That's good. So someone did a cheat. I don't support that, honestly, you guys. Not to be weird. Linda's been putting these everywhere lately. It's weird that Bernard allows it. Is Linda the girl who owns the man? The manager and Linda were thinking about firing Wendy. So Linda is that like old haggard bitch who's like jealous of the uh, big girl who was crying in the bathroom, right? Nothing. What if there was a human hand in one of those? I'd munch. Say no to divorce. I'm sorry that your parents didn't. Oh my god. Do you guys care that your parents divorced? Or no? For you guys that do have divorced parents. Honestly, I don't care. You know those kids that are just like, oh, it tore apart my family. I'm like, I don't care. Maybe that's not a good thing, but I really feel like I don't care. No, I was praying for it. They needed to. Oh my God. Mine were never married. Oh, so you're a bastard son? <laughs> or daughter, or they? So you're a bastard. Wow. See, I'm not a bastard, but my parents are divorced. You think you just fell out of a coconut tree? I need a tuna sandwich <laughs> right now on the rocks, for real. You guys, I might have to get me some McDonald's My dad tonight. keeps having random secret kids every five years. I'm glad he never married my mom. Really? Who else is an illegitimate child? Mazozi, what does that mean? That that your mom wasn't married? Or that like you kind of appeared out of nowhere on your mom's doorstep? I feel like because of your personality, it's the latter, but I don't want to assume anything. Interact. Funny how some games really stand the test of time. Oh my god, wait, there's a key here. Oh, He's period. Our snake's best friend. Okay, we have one key. Did I read this? Sounds like this is from your school days, but the name of the sender is smudged. It's hot in Texas, Anne, and it's snowing in Montreal. It's childish, but there's a snowman. And Christmas is tiring. I need to relax. How's your family? I leave Montreal on the 8th. And Harry, too. And Sister Miller, too. I will see you soon. 
the name is smudged out, but it looks like that says Pedonica. <laughs> reading simulator it's detective simulator but honestly there's just so many characters i can't really keep up you guys like i need to find this other key oh is that the key coins in my tip jar we're getting pretty lonely. oh no ah oh, that's so sweet dear soph i, I thank you every much, day michael and i love you. you oh i'm soph i'm soph thank you wait they love me they don't know I'm going through all their shit and like exposing her for being a cheating hit girl. She's not, she doesn't, no, she doesn't kill people, but she's been smacked, I mean. I didn't mean she hits people, but she has been hit herself. I am reading. I'm getting the cliff notes. What more do I need? I think I can open the chest now. Oh, I, I thought I needed two keys. Hey, Nick, I think you really need to vape like right now. You're right. Honestly, you're so right about that. <sighs> I'll need another key to unlock this. Yeah, I fucking knew it! This was just such a liar! Somewhere. Um, maybe underneath this car? Oh my god. I don't know, is this little boy hiding something? Like, I'm sorry, little boy, but your note from your dad, it's gonna have to go. Like, I'm really sorry, but all your toys are ruined just like your family. Oh no. That key looks so familiar. Okay, she's telling me where Why it is. Why do I associate it with room? Nick, I can't walk. My BF went in. Did he go into the mental institution and you're like in a wheelchair and now there's no one to push you? I'm sorry, Mama. I hope you recover soon, Mama. He'll be out soon too. Everyone gets better. It just takes time. It just takes time. 505. Okay. There was a key in here? What? Where was the key in this room now? Oh, a dick. Shinary. Yeah. Oh, there, there! Wrong key. Oh no, this is the killer's room! Where the killer was! Oh, I was trying to, not, not, not to touch shit in here, now I've just touched shit in here. I don't think fingerprints were invented yet. I don't think humans evolved to have them yet, right? Or no. Where was that key, though? I've read all of this shit. Green needle. Green needle. Oh my god. Oh my god. And they were roommates? But two women? Oh my god. So he is a fetishist of lesbian women i don't think i'll need this again that is really disturbing to me i don't support straight worse. men fetishizing gay girls mom's not too bored without her tv shows i think that's really disrespectful and very weird and like a very odd moment oh my god i just can't believe it think sophie where have you seen a key like that one before ooh, ooh. in a safe no what is this bitch talking about? Like, I swear. Huh, there you are. With Marcella. God knows where she is. Dead in a dumpster. Ooh. Clarington Hotel reception desk. Beth speaking. Hey, Beth. Bean, I've been meaning to speak with you. Oh, is he back? About what? Well, a little birdie told me Mr. Morgan and Mr. Cruz had an argument yesterday. My one gripe with this game, and tell me if I'm the only one experiencing this, I don't know who is who. Like, I get the storyline, but there's just too many people. Like, I don't know who is who. Like, I know the Cruz is the couple that this guy was stalking, but there's just too, like, I don't know who these people are, like. Really? Who's your little birdie? Shock. Apparently there's a lot of so characters. And listen to this. There's it too felt many. Like I was on the right track because he heard a particular word thrown around quite a lot. Want to guess what it is? Affair. Affair? Bingo. Hmm. Got that. Did Jack hear anything else? From what he told me, it seemed like Mr. Cruz was accusing Mr. Morgan of having an affair with his wife. So who's I'm Mr. Morgan? Fall for men like Morgan. <clears throat> I know who Mr. I Cruz is. Who's Mr. Wants. Morgan? Maybe, but 
That doesn't explain Mrs. Beaumont's involvement with Mrs. Cruz. What do you mean? I found a chest in room 507. <laughs> Don't I think ask it can me. only be opened by turning two keys at once. I found one of them in Mrs. Beaumont's The lawyer. Case. Oh, and the other one? Well, I remembered seeing I thought key in one of Mr. Cruz Martin's was the lawyer. Pictures, so I went back to check. Mrs. Cruz wears it as a pendant. It looks identical to Mrs. Beaumont's key. Wait, so Mrs. Beaumont and Mrs. Cruz own identical keys that are both needed to open a mysterious chest. Yeah, there's definitely something going on here. Um, they're having a fuck. I think Mrs. Cruz and Mrs. Beaumont might be the ones having I like the different. story. There's just That's too many questions. Like, too many theory. characters that I don't know Did who they you are. Did any clues that might support this? Nothing concrete. I mean, I did find a letter that suggests they may have gone to college together, but they could just as well be good friends, right? <laughs> yeah, that's one way to put it. I guess we'd know for sure if we could have a look at that chest, but I don't think I'll be able to okay, open so it. Okay, so we can't find the other I've key. I've looked around room 509. I would have seen the second key if it was there. Mrs. Cruz must have left with it this morning. Hmm, yeah. We were so close. I can't believe it all ends here. Well, hold on. So is I that it? I have an idea. Get me a candle and some plaster, and maybe I can do something about that pesky chest. What does the oh, story happen if you work with the guy? Because men don't have skills like, like this. They just say slurs and are rude. To leave my post. All right. But like Beth has the tea. She can actually do Come stuff. On, you know I wouldn't let you down. Okay. So she needs a candle and some plaster? Okay, hold on. I think we need to do this for all of our sakes. Characters. We know Beth. Bernard. He is the manager of the hotel. Linda is a haggard bitch who's jealous of a marriage between Wendy and Jax. Jax and Wendy are married and Linda's a gel girl. Andrew is a twink. Bobby is a chef that we've never even met. Eugene, he's allegedly in, court, in charge of maintenance. We've never met him. Rebecca does laundry. Um, I don't think we've ever met her. We have a family as well. Paul Morgan is in room 505. He's the stalker. He's the guy who is doing a stalkation against our maidation. Hector and Marcella are a dating couple. But he sleeps on the couch. And he sleeps on the couchation because of their alleged relations being rocky. Okay. And allegedly, there's an affair going on between him, no, between his wife, this girl, with the beautiful lipstick, and the stalker. So... Yeah. And Anne is a, a woman who was hit in the face with a bat. But she has a son. But she's also a cheater. But I don't think she actually is. And she had a picture of Marcella in her room. Who, to remind you, is the wife of Hector who allegedly thinks... Marcella had an affairation with Paul, who's the stalker, who's allegedly stalking us and allegedly stalking them as well. And allegedly, Anne is getting a divorce and allegedly Hector is a lawyer. Allegedly. And my headphones just turned off. Hold on. Okay, I kind of am getting it. Are you guys kind of there with me? Do you want me to start over? Should I make a PowerPoint real quick? Raymond is like a brother and a friend of the show. And Mr. Beaumont is Anne's husband, the hit guy who hit a woman with a bat. There's too many moving parts, Mama. I think maybe get the Microsoft paint out. Okay, honestly, you're right. We're gonna have to get the paint out. Like, I'm sorry, there's, there's, just, there's just no other way around it. Okay, here we go. So we... We are a woman, and our name is Sophie, marked by this red S. This is us, okay? And we, and the yellow line equals stalking. We're being stalked 
We're being stalked by Mr. Morgan, the Grey M. Okay? But he is also doing a stalkation, allegedly, of Marcella, marked by this pink M, and her husband, Hector, marked by this green H. Okay? Allegedly, this light red, this light red rind means sex. Allegedly, Marcella is fucking Paul Morgan. And Hector allegedly had a fight with him marked by this blue line. So now we're stalking this person and this person as well. This goes both ways to figure out what happened. Somewhere in the midst of all of this, there's Anne and her son Michael. And she was hit hard. Almost died. And she needs a lawyer. And this black line marks the alleged lawyeration that she is helping get away from her husband, from Hector. Does it, is it all making sense now? Is it, did I miss anyone? No, we got them all. We got them all. So that's kind of what's going on right now. And the last thing I want to note by this light blue line is there is, for some reason, a photo of Marcella in Anne's room. Okay? So... We are stalking Hector and Marcella and Morgan because he's stalking us and Hector and Marcella. And Marcella is allegedly fucking Morgan and allegedly Morgan and Hector, Hector had a fight about it. <laughs> I don't get it. Where should, what are you not getting, Koala? Wait, read you. I don't get it. Okay, so where's Sophie um, alleged by this red... S. We are stalking Hector and Marcella and Morgan because he's stalking us. And he's also stalking Hector and Marcella. Marcella is fucking Morgan. And Hector found out about it. So he's fighting with M Morgan. And Anne needs a lawyer because her husband hit, hit, beat the shit out of her. And um, that might be Hector. But he, she also had a photo of Marcella in her room. Who killed Anne. Anne is not dead. Anne was hit by her husband, who I'll mark off with this blue, uh, purple H over here, but it's not really relevant. And again, the dark blue line means a fight. I draw a stick figure comic of it. Do you really need me to do that right now? <laughs> I think we got it. Like, I think that, that kind of helps sum it up right now. You think right. you just fell out of a coconut tree? Thank you so much, Karomi. <laughs> I really appreciate that. Okay. Okay. Plaster and candles. So right now we're oh, trying to get into Anne's private suitcase because we want to know somewhere. more about who's her lawyer, how are Hector and Marcella connected to them because there's a picture of Marcella in Anne's room. So Anne must be connected to this whole triangle. You know what I'm saying? So that's where, so if we can find a candle in one of these rooms, where's the candle, you guys? Can someone wiki how it? Where's the candle? Does anyone know? Candle? 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 Sorry, I got lost. What are you talking about? Candle? Candle. Plaster? Candle gender. <laughs> Candle Kardashian. Candle. 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 <laughs> I can't believe Grimes is not allowed to see her own son. Like, that shit is really weird to me. Candle and plaster sounds like the name of a non binary couple. That's very true. Candle. Where's the candle? Gemini Void? Gemini Void? Where? Here? Here? Where? Gemini Void? Where? Here? Who? Gemini Void? Where? Where? Here? Who? It's in the break room. Thank you, Gino, Gemini. You won't regret it. the renovations, getting... there has to be plaster somewhere on this floor. Okay, where's the I plaster, though? Maybe near that, like, fucking little thing. You know the little fucking thing? 
Like that little fucking room where they had a little fucking thing in it, a little fucking like moment, a little fucking thing. And like here, like maybe here. What's plaster? I'm not. Is that like wall material? Is that plaster? Hey, this oh, okay. takes care of half of this little scavenger. Okay, right? yes, and the candle is in the down. In, it's in Re Rebecca Rebecca's downstairs. downstairs. Was Onika Burger invented yet? No, um. What year was Nikki born? She's like, what, 40? How old is Nikki? 49? How old? When was she? When was she born? 1910. I'm not sure if burgers were even invented yet, if I'm going to be frank with you. I'm going to keep it frank. Rebecca. Rebecca. Mallory. Jacqueline. No, we need Rebecca. Rebecca's locker. She must be into candles and astrology like most women. Oh my god. Are you here to apologize? Apologize? I'm not the one who should be apologizing. Nidia, I can't believe that I fell in love with you. Wait. What? I, I want my mother's ring back. There. I don't want to see what. Oh my god. So Linda's plan worked. She was trying to sabotage their marriage, and I guess it worked. God, men are just so weak. Honestly, Wendy deserves so much better. To who keeps stealing my lunch? I want my Tupperwares back. Simon. That's not appropriate. Like, I don't love stealing. I don't believe in thieving. I only believe in scamming. Nick, please watch your language. I'm watching your shoes with my I'm a zero IQ three-year-old baddie. And I'm not leaving a good impression on his young mind. I hope your son turns out like me. Fierce. I think H&M is the women T-H-E-Y-R-E-L-E-S-B-E-N-S. That's why he had a lesbian book to like educate and it's the husband W-H-O hired him to see if S-H-E-S cheating. He's worked with us for years. He's always been loyal. Is there, is there anything you might have said or done to anger him? What do you think? That I deserve this? No, no, of course not. So I Linda's like the head maybe. matron. From his perspective, well, uh, oh, never mind. What are you going to do now? I'm fired. Whatever. I'm not broke, I'm woke. <laughs> I am very with the times. You did not prevent Ugin from getting fired by Bernard. Who's Ugin? Or was there something in the copy this morning? I don't know what this subplot is. Honestly, I'm going to keep it really real with you. Wendy! Wait, no, not Wendy. Who we're looking for? Victoria, Beth. Who are we? Oh, Rebecca. Where's the candles, bitch? She doesn't even have candles. So you do have a stash of candles. The kitchen has but no power, and I need to cook some fingers. And I don't know where my candles are. Please help. Rebecca, there's a guest. Um, okay. So the candles are not here. Who else is lubing their butthole? Excuse me? There's a six-year-old watching this. I'm good. I hope you know that. And that's what you're gonna say? I mean, I don't know. I don't know where these it's candles lost. could be, honestly. I don't see any candles. I see a little maid thing. It's locked. Okay. Hold on. I think H&M is the woman they're lesbians that's why he had a lesbian book to educate the husband who hired him i don't really understand that so you think marcella is a secret <gasps> what if marcella is a secret lesbian with ann and that's why she has a picture of ann in her uh, marcella in her room and that's why her husband hit her. That, that, that could be the case here, but 
I don't think that's true because lesbians weren't that popular yet. People didn't start becoming lesbians till like 2010 or something. So I feel like there's just no way that can be true. There's just no way. You're so weird, right? Girl, what? Wait, so true, Baba. You think you just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> oh, here. <laughs> He's still in the break room. <laughs> Hi, sis. SND, big nose bitch. <laughs> lesbian was invented. When was lesbian invented? Uh, Ellen good. was the first. No, the first lesbian was King Princess. Ellen isn't a lesbian. She's like a little Keebler elf that happens to like women. Okay, so where are these candles, though? Like, I'm just not too sure about it. It's locked. Yeah, I'm just not too sure, honestly. <laughs> okay, let's just go. Sophie, oh. you're forgetting what you came here for. Um, um Green Needle, where's the unlocked. Green Needles, where's the candles, Green Needles? It's locked. I mean they've gotta be like in this little like moment. Maybe in this little box. You have to go to the key you have to get the keys in the break room. Hmm, let me look. My eyes aren't what they used to be. I kind of have aged a lot recently. I look old. I feel old. I'm gonna die soon. I'll be dead soon. You guys don't even know when I die. You'll think I'm just taking a break from streaming, but I'll be gone. And all you'll have is a distant memory of me and my diapers. <laughs> my nose. You were born at a very young age. I wasn't. I came out with a lot of feet. Two. And I had a big leg, and I walked on it. And I was weird. And I got hit. I heard a little mouse. Tempting, but every penny at the okay. mm, now's not you the got time. Got pulled out go. by my <laughs> nose. Excuse me. Key is next to the blue table with the magazine table. Okay. Oh! 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 Hallelujah. Hold on to these tight. Yes, okay. Thank God. Thank God we got this keyness for our vaginas. Feet stream when though? You guys are just down horrendous, honestly. You know the world is coming to an end when somebody wants to see my feet. I mean, like, oh my God, the world should just end Off then. limits. So what is this key for exactly? It's locked. Keep off limits. I'm just not too clever. Maybe here, this little clever moment. It's locked. No, I'm not clever. It's locked off limits. Under unlock the cabinet in the sink in the kitchen. Okay. One thing about me at for the laundry. Oh my god. The key to Victoria's secret. Her secret was child workers in a third world country. Okay, this is giving liar. Like I don't I don't think it's opening. Where is laundry? Is this laundry? Laundry. Oh, I'm just so turned around, like honestly. <gasps> <gasps> laundry. Laundry. Thank God, that took forever. Oh my god. So where's the candle? Where's the candle? Is this a candle? Oh my god, Candle Jenner, where the fuck are you? Like, why is this so complicated? I just, oh my god, like, where the fuck are these fucking candles? I'm gonna have to ask Elmo in a second. Elmo, where are these candles? Oh, thank you, Elmo. You ate that. Uncovered. Got a candle. Thank God. Now, what next? Nothing. We go to bath. Around. We go to bath. I need Barbie Dreamhouse with an with an iPhone. There you are. This is my gay girl, I'm not by sure the way. I understand what the plan is here. Well, when I was little, who do you think munches and who gets munched? On many of the farm's sheds. My, oh my dad God. would always lose the keys, so one day he made a mold of them using wax and plastic. I have mold, black mold, growing in both my bathrooms Are you and sure in my it's sink. Gonna work? Absolutely not. But hey, I guess we won't know until we try. Yeah. This is very right. risky and so very dangerous. Let's do this. 
Oh, that's dangerous. Why is the water going through the bottom of it, though? Oh, okay. God. To start, we need to pour the wax from I have to do this? I don't want to do this. Can't it. you just do it, Mama? Like, oh my god, I want to vape and before? be like a queen. You're a real pro. Okay, what next, Mom? Now, time to put the key into the wax. Let's give it a few seconds so the mold really takes form. What are we doing? Hey, okay, I think you can remove it. Like, I don't understand this at all. Like, what? what is happening right now? Well, we're almost there. Just pour the cup of plaster into the mold. Oh, this is how they make hearing aids. All right. What that girl has on um, Great British today? Bake Off. How long do you think it's It goes in your little ear and it, like, know. amplifies sound. We'll keep poking oh, it okay, it. yeah, I got it. I bet I got you didn't it. think you'd be making a plaster key today, huh? <laughs> Indeed. But I like it. It's rare that this job allows me to use my creative side. They need the Pink Friday two nails. Side. Well, granted, this Them key hands look haggard as the Madonna but hands. I enjoy the I, That sink is so loud, I just can't focus. Oh, like drawing? Like drawing? Oh, oh God, no. God. I once drew a dress that everyone mistook for a birthday hat. <laughs> I never drew again after that. What Lesbians, about you? would you? Haven't I seen you drawing in that journal of yours? Yeah. I doodle a oh, little. We're an artist. Hey, you should show me one day. Oh I'd love God. to see your art. Um, okay. Okay, but promise not to laugh. What? I I never ever do that. I know I make fun of pretty much everything, but This is not like a flirty little art. gay shit. That's their soul. I'm oh sure God. it's beautiful. Thanks. Oh my god. What do you like to draw anyway? I'm getting it's my pussy ate today. I started working on this little comic in which I imagine my life as a celebrity. A celebrity? Yeah. I've always found the lives of famous people so fascinating, you know? And I kind of envy them sometimes. She's jealous of Angel oh, Mommy the 13. Drama. The excitement. She's so yeah, jealous of Angel Mommy really 13. Yeah, because we're really excitement today. <laughs> well, today's the yeah. I'm sure there's something else in your life that excites you. Well... I do like sailing. Like her. Excuse me? You sail? On a boat? I'm a gay girl. I also I play lacrosse like other gay with girls. With my grandpa. But when he died, oh. we had to sell the boat to pay off his debts. Oh, that's too bad. I would have loved to go with you. Maybe we can go together. Should we be gay or normal? I don't know. Like, it's a, it, it was a different time. What if we get burned at the stake? Gay? What if we get burned at the stake, though? Like, is it a bad ending if we're gonna be a lesbian? Be a gay role model? You don't get anything. Life doesn't repay you for being a good person. You should always be the worst possible person you can be. Maybe it'd be possible to borrow a boat for a day. Hey, that's a slur! I think one of Grandpa's friends still has his. Really? No that slurs! Would be great. I just love trying new things. I'll see what I can do. Oh hey, look. I think it's dry. I can't believe it worked. I could not have done this without you. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> well, I should get back upstairs before Bernard notices my absence. If he hasn't already. Let me know how it goes with the key. Oh, and uh, be careful while turning it, okay? You wouldn't want it to break inside the lock. Yeah, I'll be careful. Thank you for everything. No problem. It sounds like Tinkerbell taking a little pee next to the oasis of the gods. Doesn't it? I can hear the liquid moving between her flaps. I love you, Tinkerbell. You're my hero. She pees just like me. <laughs> Tinkerbell is so me. We both like pee. Okay, let's go. Did I, did I pick up the key? Clean. Yeah, I gotta hide the evidence, honestly. 
You're so crazy, Nick. I'm not. I'm the most sane person you'll ever meet. Here are some qualities about me. Beautiful. Smart. Um, I got a vaccine, so I have the woke mind virus. Um, which I think is a plus. Um, and also... We need two keys, Jamila. Because for some reason her suitcase has two keyholes. Did I leave that closed? I don't know about smart or beautiful. But you agree that I'm woke? Thank you. I am woke. Oh, this is the soccer's room. Let me get out of here before- Oh, I should close this or he's gonna know that I was in there. Mama, close that. So what, what, what room was Anne's? Not, no, the Anne's room had the little fort in it for the little bitch kid. That played a little bitch thing. A little bitch way. And a little bitch, little, little, oh. Oh no, that someone was in the shower, but they're not. Okay, now Be we- Careful, Sophie. You don't want this key to break. Okay. Oh, I have to turn it myself. Okay, this one can't break. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Okay, can I practice with this one? Oh, fuck, it's too late. Oh, fuck. Fuck, okay. Slow and steady wins the race. <sighs> Nicholas, you've been slow all your life, mentally. You can do this. I'm slow. for dear life. I'm moving it. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I'm gripping the sink right now. Oh, my God. It's coming out of me like lava. Oh, fuck me. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm going to need more toilet paper. Oh, God. Exactly. That is some real girl gaming. That is some real girl gaming right there. Thank you. Could XQC do that? No, he couldn't. Um, In Atlanta, my I saw. bar. This one was black. Her alliterative. Name. I'm a zero IQ three year old baddie. <laughs> These two sure love their riddles. More puzzles. Head mod. Head bob cocking in. Hey mama. Cock. I hope you get better and you have some soup as well. There's a ticket oh. here. Martha, there's a lot of stuff in here. I don't think I've looked at everything yet. I might have to call my sources, you guys. Dear Annie, I, there's a Doris Day. Oh, I love Doris Day. I'm a really big fan. I'm a really big Doris Day fan. Let's get it going. Let's get the, the little um, Doris Day going. I'm a really big fan of Doris Day. You guys already know that I'm a really big fan. Oh, give me your attention. There's been a new invention. It isn't any larger than an adding machine. It's I have lungs and I climbed something so as a, a teenager. And there was a Montreal. And I have a picture of us. I love you, Em. It doesn't do division and it doesn't multiply. It doesn't want to be a bird, it doesn't try to fly. It came about because they made a big atomic bomb. The new invention's clicking, and because of all it's ticking, I know where the idea came from. I tick, tick, tick. What a lie. Tick, tick, tick. What a me tick, tick, tick. I tick, tick, tick. And I'm an electric tick. When I feel a you're such an attractive hick. Give me a radio It's distracted the way you stick, but love makes me tick, 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 and my heart beats quick. How can anything go wrong? When I'm listening to that Geiger counter song, I tick, tick all day. You think you just fell out of a coconut Thank you so much, 14, for the 14. Thank you, Mama. Okay, someone I took dick, this for TikTok. Dick. 
Ready? <gasps> she was a lesbian! Oh my god, this explains everything! Did someone get that? So she was a lesbian. Look, M, here. As you can see, M, so this was M, remember, married to H, who was being stalked by Morgan. They had a fight because he thought that Morgan was fucking Maria, Marcella. But in reality, Marcella was fucking Anne. And the husband hired Morgan to stalk Marcella to find out who she's fucking. That's probably why he was stalking us. Because he wanted to know if I was the bitch that was being gay with another female. They're both girls, though. Don't act like we've, we've all seen two girls get it on, you know? You know, come on. Let's be adults here. We, we've all seen it. Sing, I'm not singing. Only God sings. And I'll sing one day when I join his choir. Do you want to be there with me at God's choir? I love you. And so does God. Find him. He wants you to come home. So now that kind of confirms why we were getting stalked, in my opinion. You know, I think we were getting stalked because he thought, you know what? If one girl's gay in this hotel, they're probably all gay. Because you know how the gay girls are and the gay guys and the gay things and its and leaders and royalties. We all kiki together. Where there's one little freak, there's two, three, four, five, sometimes ten. That's probably what he was thinking. So I think that's why he was stalking us. Okay, I think my sources are going <gasps> to... Boy hair! God, she has boy hair. I should have known all along. I should have known all along. Oh my God. <laughs> right, she has boy hair. We should have known all along. Oh my God, she really has boy hair, seriously. And the letters say, La Tempe Passi Saivite. Oh my God, not La Tempe Passi Saivite. <gasps> the Tempe Passy Saivite. And my parents went to the La Tempe Passy Saivite. And another woman. And the La Tempe Passy Saivite. I had a lot of time to reflect. And I have feelings for you, La Tempe Passy Saivite. We can't hide gayness any longer. But it can't last. Our love is gay, so it's forbidden. And hiding is hurting. And you have a heart. And so do I. But we break up. You made me feel like a teenager. Oh my god, this is like that Katy Perry song. La Tempe Passe Saivite. So Marcella called things off with Anne because she realized you have boy hair. They're gonna know there's something up if we're hanging out. Cause like, why do you have boy hair? So they had to break up for their future as straight women. So who's in the wrong? <laughs> okay, but that doesn't explain what the code is. Is there a code or um, did I make that up? Where was the code? Was there a code or did I make that up? There's a soup and a letter as well as a part de d'enfant, le tempi passe vite. Is this a code or like, do I have to care about this? That riddle is a duffy. Maybe I need a friend. Oh, I'll call Beth. How many numbers are in a lesbian? Two. Minimum. You ran <laughs> that suitcase? Bitch, I'm a snowsy little hey, bitch! Got a minute? For you, always been. I opened the chest in room 507. Where are you all did? these people, by the way? Damn, I have to like, admit, I didn't really believe in our little Where are, where are these people? Go. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised as well. It's quite sturdy. Dead, so, dead, dead, What's in the dead, chest? dead, dead. Riddle. Riddle? I How do you guys want to die? Mrs. Beaumont for Mrs. Cruz. 
And I think I want to die by losing my leg. For a case I found in room 509. I could People both feel really bad for though. me, and then they could oh, freeze God, my leg, I and someone could rules. have it and well, cuddle with it. it. And I have Which nice legs in my sleep. I don't want to die in my sleep, because if you die in your sleep, that means you don't ever really die. Like, because you don't die. If you die in your sleep, you're not dying. You're just not waking up. And you'll never know. You won't know that you're dead. You'll just think you're asleep. Isn't that kind of poetically cruel? You won't know that you're dead. You'll be thinking, I'm going to wake up soon for, like, all of eternity. But you won't. And everything around you will just vanish as years and years go by, and you just won't even know that you're dead. I don't like that. I want to know that I'm dead so I can make peace with it. I think you'll know. You won't know, Miss Angelina girl. Do you know when you're asleep? No. You think you're sleeping. Drop it like Lotto, bitch. Lotto dropped off the charts because she has a big fucking forehead. I need my babe. You won't have a brain. You know your soul's in your brain, not your heart. You can get a heart transplant, but not a brain you think transplant. You just fell out of a if you get a brain tree? transplant, you have a new soul. <laughs> That's what happened to Avril Lavigne. Heroes never die. That is not true. <laughs> Here he goes. Cordelia, you're literally named after a witch. That means you're weird. So don't come for me. So she has a new name. Um, her alliterative name. You think you just fell out of a coconut that. tree? Alliterative what now? <laughs> Andrew, you're a nerd. What's alliterative? Hey, just because That is when it's like a messy Mondays, right? Alliterative, messy Mondays. You think you just fell out Frankie of a coconut Cucci. tree? Sassy sister, like Thank two you, of the darling. same letter. Did you get my uni Nick Scavo? Yeah, you I look did. so kawaii today. Thank you, Uni. You're my queen card and my little Afa. I think I know what to do. <laughs> do? Great. Sassafras McDarling. Tiger dishes. No, there's also a bar. Here's another one. Unlike my favorite bar, this one was black. Do you know what this could mean? Not a clue. You said Mrs. Beaumont Maybe she typically goes white. for white chocolate, yeah, but she had all the dark no chocolate Twix that night. Is. I think I do. Really? I had a Twix today, How? I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That's a story for another time. But if I had to right. bet, I'd put my money on the white cat. The white <laughs> cat. I get it. I, I know, I, I got I it. it, I got it. Well, that wasn't too hard, was it? I got it. Anything else I can help you with? No, nope, I'm good. No, nope, that's all. I got it. Thank you. Ah, uh, don't mention it. I'm just glad I could be of some help. Call me after you've opened that case. You know I will. I'm a zero IQ three-year-old baddie. Seven dollars into VIP. When you lose your legs, can I have them? My six-year-old son has no legs and he could really use them. <laughs> if you guys, if one of you guys actually has a son, that's so cute. Will you tell them like that you looked up to me and that like you'll teach them my values? That really warms my heart, girls. Thank you for that. Thank you. No, no. I I sometimes say things that are quite wise. What value is black lug vape? No, Matt. First of all, the value that I would teach a young vapor is get the 3%, not the 5%. Because it's better bang for your buck. Because you don't, you know, when you vape it, you're not getting that, like as much nicotine, so you're not getting as addicted to it. You'll use less. That's the values and the percentage I would teach the youth. Go for the three, not the five. There you go. Sometimes I feel like I'm quite wise. I do think I'm a very loving person. Whatever that means. You do give great advice for younger gays, dating older men who are just taking advantage of them. I'll give you that. That's one of the many wise things I've said. Ask me anything. 
That was very wise, Big Scavo. Thank you. Large and in charge, Big Scavo. You guys, so what's this um code? Also, where do I even put it in? Like, I don't understand what I'm even meant to be doing. So, I need to find something related to a black cat and a person whose first and last names start with the same letter. The values being a kingdom of Down syndrome. That was not me. That was my clone. You guys keep forgetting that I was cloned and locked away when I was 15 years old. And they made me say really horrible things like car crash Selena Gomez and other things. You know, and I've crossed many lines when it comes to car crash victims and people with dyslexia. But I respect other lines. I don't make fun of lesbians. And you were funnier back then? Oh my god! See, you guys are worse than me and you're always trying to make me try to feel bad. We have to get in here though, still. Oh guys, what is it? When I was nine, I was in a plane crash. People who were in plane crashes are so annoying. That's like people who almost die. Everyone who almost died is so annoying, you must wish they did. Cause like, we don't want to hear about it. Like, I'm just trying to live my life. <laughs> I picked up all my ignorant traits of you. I'm not ignorant! You say as you made a GoFundMe for your mom's fake car crash. No, that's you thinking that women can't get in car crashes. That's your bad. You all Bella Thorin. Rin <laughs> Bella Thorin. <laughs> I can't read. You were? You all Bella Thorin. Ignorant. Okay, I'm not ignorant anymore. I'm Now I'm educated. I'm educated. And you know what? Since it's the season of thanks, I will thank you guys for educating me on a lot of things. Because you guys really have. Some of you are way worse than me and worse. But I am educated. Nick, shut up. Are you threatened by my degrees of education? Nick Davenade's fake gay annoying. You need to be educated. You Apologize think you just fell out of a Lizzo. coconut tree? I can't. She blocked me. <laughs> what is the code? What is the code? 18 months on our gay man on man <laughs> relationship mama. Meows. <laughs> Gay on gay violence. Can you do an education stream? I do know a lot about igneous rocks. I really do. It's gris. Thank you. That's all I needed to know. Okay, here we are. Thank you. I knew it. I was just testing you guys. <laughs> I have a little rumble in my belly. I need some din din. Oh, I should heat up some leftovers. Oh, I love food. Oh my god, no way. That novelist, Bridget Boswell, is actually you, Marcella? She wrote the book on lesbian pornography? I prefer a good crime story, and there was a. <gasps> Marcella wrote the gay girl book! When they went to Cubic. And they were thieves. Is it about Anne? Oh my god. After all this, turns out you're a fan of Bridget? Of Marcella? That's a lot sweeter than Oh I my god. I don't know what that one means, but... Fuck. There's a lot of stuff in here. No, I have. I don't think I've looked at everything yet. No, I have. Oh, Anne. Oh. I do like a happy ending. And Okay, so they were like in love. My brother is working. Meet me there. We can have gay sex. So she was cheating on her husband. Honestly, I do have an unpopular opinion about this. And this is my wokeness coming through. I don't think it matters if you're gay or not. If you want to be gay, you should not cheat on somebody. Like, just leave them. and Because you're still a cheater. Like, I don't like that. That's like when, you know, there's like an old man and he's like is secretly fucking men on his business trips and then his wife has to find out. Like, I don't like that. Like, I don't care if you're gay. Like, you're a cheater first. I don't like that. But you know what? This was a different time. So I feel like it's probably a little bit different, honestly, because like it was a different time. You know, like they, they, they really couldn't. They had a secret gay girl language. 
Lesbians, can you speak this? Oh my god. You are so hodophobic and anti-women. I also make the best stuffing this side of the Southwest. <laughs> oui, oui. <laughs> so let's see here. There was a novel coming out. Oh, so the novels is how they wrote stories of their love. Well, Marcella. Oh my God. Rose. So they're talking about the book right now. We don't really care. Um, she's using a fake name because she doesn't want to be gay. Oh. Oh my so God. You came to Montreal under the pretense of celebrating your wedding anniversary. But all along... This is, this is good drama! She, okay, this is Anne saying she left her, her gay husband because she has boy hair. And she's like, how do you manage to live a double life? Hide your work and your novels from your husband. Michael and I are staying at the hotel until we get a divorce. Could you see me in Montreal? Oh my god. Holy fuck. Okay, wait, I think I missed some shit here. I'm glad you were able to open up to Marcella like Marcella this. was a weird Everyone little needs girl. To talk to. Oh my god, too much reading though. So they like, who's Paul? Who's Paul? Who's and Paul? It's on my salary. Oh, is he the book publisher? You, but what for? Oh, Paul! Morgan Paul! Hold on, go back. Say, I'm your biggest fan, your novel. Oh, he pretended to be a fan? To stalk her! Dear Marcella, I received a letter from Lindsay. She's dead. Words can't describe how he died in the letter. And I know I have feelings for it. My feelings for him. Wait, what? I just received a letter from Lindsay, mother, and he's dead. I don't know how empty I feel. He died two years ago, but even after I sent my first letter, he was gay? We don't care if you're white, don't care if you're black, we don't care if you're gay, we're all under attack, we don't care if you're rich, don't care if you're poor, we don't live in, vote for Trump. We don't need no liberal Trump, we're in, vote for Trump. We don't need no liberal Trump. Wait, so is it a, okay, it's a gay girl with a boy hair girl on her husband, but Paul, here, here, hold on. I Don't worry, you guys, I got you. So, this gay girl was fucking this other boy hair gay girl. And this gay guy didn't know about it. This guy, who's the stalker, we don't know if he's pretending to be a fan of her and pretending to be gay, but allegedly he's saying he's a big fan of her books because he's secretly gay. Allegedly. I think that's not true and he's just trying to be a little stalking creature. Let me get this straight. Nick Mrs. Don Byers. And Mrs. Should I delete my Will Byers emote now after the allegations? Seems like we're gonna it. have yeah. to. But I'm not sure whether they chose to meet here just to reconnect for a We're gonna have to. Or if we're boycotting to Noah Schnapp for having really well, weird I uh, morals. To help with that. Really? How? Oh, some mail arrived earlier for Mrs. Beaumont. Bring back Nick Dom Dog. Amaryse, do you ever imagine me like in a little tail? <laughs> Open it, bitch. You've opened it, right? <laughs> me? Disregarding someone's privacy? Of course not. <gasps> but it's you if you I lived in Toronto? Bad. What does that mean? Or have we been bad influences on each other? I guess we'll never know. So? What's in it? It's three train tickets. And, uh... Oh, a Anne, Marcella, and Michelle. California. Well, it makes sense. It's much more progressive there than it is here. So, Anne and Marcella want to go there to live their love freely. Anne and Marcella, huh? You three are best pals now? Well, after reading so much of their correspondence, I kind of feel like I know them. Wait. You know? Yeah. Sophie's really weird. 
exposing a closeted gay couple before it was socially acceptable to be gay. Sophie's kind of a bad person. This has nothing to do with her. Like, she's kind of a bitch. But Sophie is also gay. Oh, so you're saying because she's a lesbian, she has the right to know which other pussies might be available for her strap. So they're going to go have a threesome and they're going to grow lunch and trees and thrive in a little seaside town by the Gulf of Mexico? Stop dream daydreaming and start working. Get a job. What about Mr. Morgan, though? I mean, Paul. That's what I'm... Yeah, how does he fit into this? He was a fan of Marcella. Marcella hired him. I don't know. How does he fit into all of this? I'm trying to do some critical thinking right now. He's bisexual, so he's weird. So he does weird stuff like stalk people. He's a gay male, love, and he wants LGBT friends. I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly. I'd say Hector hired him to find out about his wife's affair. You think he just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> I think Gay girl Marcella hotel. Is the one who hired him. Who hired him? It seems he's a fan of her novels, so I'm confused. Wow, <laughs> me too. And why did he have those pictures of you? I guess we'll never know for sure, but I don't think it was ever about me. It's always been about Anne and Marcella. Exactly. Oh well, it feels a tad anticlimactic, but no. But why did he have the pictures? I assumed it's because maybe. Really interesting. If Hector hired Paul to find out if his wife was, like, liking girls with boy hair, then I get why he had pictures of us, because he wanted to know if I was the boy hair girl. But if Marcella hired him, why would he have pictures of me? Sure did. You know, after today, I think I get why you're so interested in the lives our guests lead. I try to forget they exist as soon as I'm done interacting with them. But once in a while... Sophie Anderson is a nasty slut? That, well, even the and she drank tea out of a funnel right from girls, some girl's vagina? On the other side of the door. <sighs> and who are you behind closed doors? A gay girl? What about you? Who is Beth Lambert when no one's looking? I like to think that with me, what you see is what you get. But maybe in let her extra cook. Snoopy let her cook some gay stuff, like a layers. tiramisu. Maybe ones I didn't even know I had. <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> Come see me when your shift ends. All right? We could leave together if you want. Sure. If we're we able want to. Sophie's yeti. With all that snow, her green I'm thinking needles. maybe we'll have no choice but to spend the night here. A sleepover. We could set up a pillow fort on the mezzanine. A pillow fort? We do work. I'm literally gonna get my black and blue dress out of my fucking bra. Isn't my way so much more fun? Well, <laughs> we could take a page out of Michael's book. Why are they so it. weird? I know, as an yeah, ace person, this game is really offensive. Like, comes seriously. Oh, now you're talking. <laughs> <laughs> is that the end? But what about my little hair pin? I just That's have in my to little hair. My tasks for the day, and then I can leave. I'm done. Okay, let me make sure I like hide all my evidence. I feel like. Oh my god. <laughs> Sophie's so crazy. We can't take her anywhere. She's literally in the draw right now. Oh my god, did she shrink? Wait, did she shrink? Or is she just like a little bitch? I can't tell if she's shrink. Oh my. Am I a little girl now? Okay, no, I think I'm normal. 
<laughs> we have to hide all of our egg ones. Or who knows what will happen. This game is like three to six hours. Oh, that's enough gaming for today then. <laughs> I think I've cleaned everything. Like, I think we're good to go, right? Where's my clipboard? Let me turn. Hello? Green needle. Okay, looks like I'm done, doesn't it? Perfect. Everything's crossed off, that's good. Blood? <gasps> Wait, there is blood! Who the fuck was it a kill on? I see a boy shoot, but there's lesbians in this game too. Who is the kill on him? Who the fuck is that? Who the fuck is that? Who is that? Is that a gay girl or a boy? That's Beth? Don't touch anything, Sophie Anderson, who drank pee out of a funnel from That's some girl's gross. vagina. It was Hector? Marcella's husband? Mr. Cruz. What the fuck? Oh God. Oh God. What happened? Well, don't touch anything, Mama! No, I need to know the drama. I'm a smooth. Is this about... Dear Mr. Oh. Cruz, thank you for reporting the guest's exactly. behavior. I'm informed that we cannot divulge the guest's info, and we are concerned with the privacy. Do not bother again. He was complaining about Paul. What's that? Mr. Cruz's life insurance policy. Why did he have this on him? Marcella killed him for the money? so she could start a new life in California by the Gulf of Mexico growing olives with her gay girlfriend with a boy haircut. $10,000. That was a lot of money back in the day. Back in the day, that was probably like $11,000. Oh my God. What the fuck? We have to call Beth. Candle gender, we need you now. Make a call, call Beth, call Beth. Why can't I call Beth? Oh my god, we have to hide. No, this could be the killer's room! Oh fuck. Run, mama. I don't want to run towards the blood, mama. Why can't I count call her? Phones need power? I thought landlines didn't need power back in the old days. I have to get the power back. Thank God I have this screwdriver. It's too big. Oh, fuck. I guess I'll need something. I know, I know. Here. I know, I know, I know. I know what to do. There's a knife in one of these rooms. Is it on the, whose room is that in? I wanna say 505. Right, there's a knife on the table. Yes, here. I can't use that? I got nothing! I got nothing, Scooby! Raggy! I got nothing! Oh my god, where's something pointy? Oh, someone's in the shower. Oh, fuck. Hide, mama? I can't hide. I'm a female. Like, what am I gonna do? Hide? Maybe check the other side of the hallway. Where there's a bleed? There's a whole bleed over here. Oh my God. The murder weapon. I can use the murder weapon. Empty your inventory. I don't know. I didn't know you could do that. 
The ice pick. So the killer used the ice pick in the foyer. How do I empty it? Think, Sophie. Think. What can you use to open the fuse box? I mean, I could use that, but I think that's the murder weapon. So I'm gonna go ahead and say no. We're not gonna use that. Oh, I could use a smoke. A B. Anne. Anne Beaumont. Maybe Anne did the killation of the alleged male. Oh fuck. The screwdrivers too. I don't want to use that, you gay people, in my phone. Like, they're they're gonna know that I have a murdering moment. Like, I'm not a murderer. I'm a maid. Like. Hello. Is anyone in? Hello. I need backup. Surely if I just stand around long enough, somebody will come. Like, I'm not using the ice pick. No way. This can wait. No way. No way. Then my finger is going to be on the new thing. Like, I can't have my new on that new for that. Fine. Wait, I know where gloves are. Wait, Ann, Ann has gloves. Ann has gloves. That's not Ann's room. Oh no, my headphones just turned off. I won't be able to hear the killer coming. Oh no. Nyet, 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 Nyet. Okay, Ann, 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 Ann. I can't take them. Are you kidding me? Okay, guys, think. What else have I seen that I could use? I'm thinking really hard, but I'm not so beautiful. I, you have to use it, I fear. So the game forces you to be stupid? You can use this stick? It's that small and pointy? Use the goddamn ice pick. Okay, master, anything for you. I'll use it. Okay. This looks like something I can use to open oh the fuse box. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go, kitten, go. I'm going. Can you not, um, women weren't taught how to run until the 1990s. Ice pick it, ice pick it. That worked, thank God. Inspect. No. Oh, this is some like real back. straight guy shit. How does Eugene do this again? Mm, sources. I'm gonna need I my sources. Need fuses. I'm gonna need my sources. How does Eugene do this again? Oh God. Use it. Yes. This is what okay. I need. Okay. Um. Yes. Perfect. And then. How does Eugene do this again? Fuses. Oh, I need another new for I my new and my new. Fuses. Where's my new? Where's my new? There's my new. There's my new. Okay. Okay. Got it. Period. Mm, no power. Oh God. I think I need okay. To change all of the blown fuses. Okay. There we go. There we go. Mm, no power. Oh God. I think I need to change all of the blown fuses. Oh God. Okay. 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 Let's use our brains. So 15 is is a low number, A is a low letter, so we'll do that. And then 30, and then 20 would be G because it's like the closest. And then this would be S because 30 is a late number and S is a late number. Nothing. Mm. Maybe I need to move some things around. Okay, I think I had my math backwards. I'm gonna do S here because S connects to another S. And G also connects to us.
France. Okay, so I'm gonna go put this ice pick back because I have a bad feeling that if I get caught with this, I'll actually be going to prison for 11. Ugh. Hate to be him on a Tuesday, Saturday. God, I love Big Macs. Okay, I'm gonna put this back because fingerprints weren't invented yet, so. I don't like that this game forces you to be really stupid. These look like Marcella's, Marcella's pearls. pearls. What happened here? Well, I'll tell you what happened here. Marcella is weird. Oh, so Paul, with you're Marcella really was weird. To follow her around like a private investigator to help her with research for her novel. Oh, so Marcella did hire him. Paul really got into his role. Oh, okay. So now we know that Paul was hired by Marcella. He followed Marcella to Montreal even though she was done with her research. Oh, and then he started stalking her as well, like a weird thing. Poor Paul. Montreal is big, and the really city is big, on. and I'm lonely, and I don't he speak French. The, headspace. the hotel is crazy. I have a flower. Hector was gone. My band died. Lindsay is gone. Marcella is great. Oh. So I think he's continuing to stalk her because he's a bit lonesome in his um, gay life. This is really Nine mouthy. Five. Like, this is too much. So, Anne and Marcella met here this morning while I was busy cleaning room 504. Okay, so that's a little bit of lore there. Can I really not put this back? Well, why does the game force you to be a dumb bitch? Like, I don't like that. Hello? I like... I need help. It's giving I'm a dumb bitch. I don't want to be a dumb bitch. I want to be a queen card. Oh, that wire. What was that? Oh my god. Beth is probably dead. Lobby. Beth is de We're gonna have to kick this guy out of the- I'm sorry, I don't want to disrespect the dead, but like, get the fuck out of the way. I need to use this elevator, seriously. Is there anything I've forgotten? Once I leave this floor, I- How do I be a girl? I have an extra pillow in my hand, but I don't know what bed it goes to. Like... And I have my new... Like, I don't want to get caught with all this shit on me. Why can't I put... Like, shit. I want to, like, get rid of my ice pick. Stairs. When were stairs invented? In janitor? Maybe in... No, this bed has both its pillows, too. I, can I just throw some shit out? Oh my god, this is horrible. I'll never know. I'll never see the light of day. Okay, I guess we're leaving. Like, I don't know. I mean, it's horrible. Just, no, we're gonna have to use the, yeah. Sorry, Hector, but. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, but we gotta I'm get sorry. it. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm, sir, I don't. It's, it, you know what? That'll probably be the last time you move in your afterlife, so you're welcome for that. We're still going to prison. Oh, fuck. Where's Beth? Phone. I, I need a phone. Where the fuck is everyone, bitch? Beth? Everyone. Where the fuck is everyone? Hello. Hello. Anybody down here? Hello. 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 I'm kind of spooked. I don't like this game anymore. Oh my 
God, I hear like a little fucking thing. There's been a murder. There's a man dead. How long is He's this game? 20 I, hours. I need the police. I'm about one hour in. Oh, Where are you right now? The lobby. But the body, it's it's upstairs. Can you give me the address, please? One. Oh, um, one. 1178 Drummond Street. All right, ma'am. Oh Officers are on their way. Thank you. Green eyes. That means in, that means our ancestors were inbreeding, but not that close ago. Not that far. Brown eyes mean there's no inbreeding in your lineage. Blue eyes means your great grandma probably fucked her brother. Hazel green eyes means like probably your great 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 grandma or something. Oh fuck! Is a chandelier gonna fall on me and make my boobs come out of my top? I hope so. I hear a girl with a foot. Oh, hey you. Great timing, right? I'm thinking if we're lucky, Bernard will let us go home. No point in working in the dark. Sophie? Bean, you're not scared of the dark, are you? Hey, I've seen a death! Everything okay? I found Mr. Cruz. Hector. Oh, you did? What was the bloke up to? You don't understand. I found his body. He's... He's... Merde. 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 Sit down, okay? You'll be dead soon too, Beth. You look kind of old. Merde. 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 She does not care. But why would, like, why would a woman care about a man dying? He was probably going to abuse her like Have all men do. Have you called the police? Yeah, they're... Have you thought about drawing your eyebrows on less harsh, was Beth? Was there an accident? No. I don't think so. Oh my god, Merde. Someone did this to him. Oh. You mean... Merde. 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 Marcella? Merde. Yes, I do. I... Yes. I found Merde. found Hector that would point to that. Yes. Wait, so... You this game is so slow? Is the, the FPS slow? Body? Or are you saying it's boring because you have ADHD? I mean, yes, Merde? Kind of. Sophie, oh rule number one when stumbling upon a dead body. Do not touch. It could really get you in trouble. <sighs> so, what did you find? There was A little moment and a little thought. Made it sound like Marcella would get a lot of money from her husband's death. Ugh. Throw the affair into the mix and you get a pretty good motive. That's what I'm thinking. I'm probably going to hell for saying this. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'm going to hell anyway. But I can't really blame her if she did it. Merde. Oh, and the murder weapon's in my pocket. <laughs> Fuck, we're going to fucking jail. We're gonna get our, we're gonna if we weren't gay already, we're gonna get turned out, bitch. Oh my god. Our pussy's gonna be like a porta potty. Bitches in and out of that shit. I mean I don't think she's justified in killing him though. Like, not to be anti feminist, I don't think anyone should commit murder. I don't like death. I think death is like so not good. You know what I'm saying? Like, why would she kill him? She was cheating on him and having an affair for many years and planning to run off with a boy hair girl. And, like, he gets killed? So you hate women? Nick dominates anti-women? It's love. Okay, I can see that. You know what? I don't think Marcella did it. I think Anne did it because she was jealous that he had boy hair. And her hair was not boy. Maybe Paul did it without telling Marcella. Beth did it. Woman beater. Crime of passion. Oh yeah, come on, you guys. Keep it going. I wanted him. And big tone. Le temps passe vite merde. 
and Victoria male question mark okay you guys let me over yeah not being able to be with the person you love must be you so should kill somebody if they're not doing exactly what you want wanting to find a way to escape <laughs> Right! I mean, oh, yes, of course! Excuse murder, but I understand. <laughs> I'm glad you do. Just fucked up some Chuck E. Cheese. No. What are you, nine? I've been with a woman before. Ziva Rivers. She's a... That explains the boy hair. A photographer in New York. We were together for a while, and... I was so And you annoyed. killed someone, Beth? You Wait, she has a pearl in her earring! We found pearls up there! I guess like anything that intense it wasn't meant to Uploaded last. new clue. But clue downloading. Last... Wait, what if she was up there? Never been. And if something had come between us, kept us apart. Oh my god. I would have done just about anything to be with her. Maybe Well maybe that's what happened here with Anne and Marcella. Harsh eyebrows. Thank you. Thank you for trusting me with this. What if Beth Maybe did a now kill? Maybe understand why I care so much about you. I don't know if I'm feeling. What if it was Sabrina Carpenter? Because she was trying to film a music video here shock of being for a so song that would only get two million murder, views on but, YouTube. Um, I'd really like for us to be more than just friends, Sophie. Touched and tasted, pussy. Touched and tasted. Should we be gay girls? But look what gayness has done. See how, what happens when you're gay? It leads to other sins. Like I told you guys, the L in LGBT stands for liar. It also stands for killing. L G B T Q U I A. Assassination. Assassination. Okay, I'm here for it. I love gay girls. Yeah. I... I like that too. Uh, that's... <laughs> that's great. So touch and taste it. But she's the like, is here. wait, there's a window. If the cops see us being gay, Just we're gonna get burned at the stake. Be mindful of what you tell them, okay? Yeah. I won't tell them anything. I'll just say I'm I'm a maid. I I'm a girl. Oh my god. You look so much like Beth. What are you, 40? With the name Head Barb? <laughs> Miss Roy? That's Miss Roy. Sophie Roy to you. Miss Roy. Oh. This was the beginning of the game! I was Is this the end? Distracted. I really need you to focus right now. I don't want to be oh here God, all night and I'm sure you don't eat. So bad. My little nose no. needs to be picked so bad. No, I don't. So, as I was saying, we're trying to ascertain the circumstances of Mr. Cruz's death. Can you tell me how you came to find the body? I... I was doing my I was rounds. I room 509 when I heard the elevator bell ring. Again and again and again. I thought maybe a child was playing with the doors. So I went out in the corridor. And that's when... That's when I saw him. All the blood and... Why was the elevator bell ringing? I'm sorry? You said you heard the elevator bell ring. Why was it ringing? I assume it wasn't a child after all. I'm gonna tell the truth. Well, Mr. Cruz's body was preventing the doors from- I'm gonna tell the truth. Really? When we found the body, it wasn't that close to the doors. Oh, um, the stairs are blocked because of the renovations, so the elevator's the only way out of the fifth floor. I- I had no choice but to move the body. Just a little. Ah, so that explains the traces we found. Thank you for clearing that up. So... What yes. did you do after that? Well, um, that's when the power cut. So I had to go to the janitor's closet. To access the fuse box. Exactly. Hmm. I, I changed a few fuses and turned the power back on. 
But there's a lock on that box, isn't there? Did you have the key? <laughs> Women are good at lying. I think I could get away with this. <laughs> okay, maybe lie here. <laughs> I would lie. <laughs> I would personally. Hold on, I don't know. Let me access my clues. Ooh. Accessing clues. I'm gonna lie. No, I didn't. Only Eugene does. But the box wasn't locked. Isn't that unusual? Well, maybe Eugene forgot to lock it last time he used it. I'm not a suspect! Hmm. Or maybe someone tampered with it. Did that you go near true. the ice machine at any point today? Yes. I did. Yes. Um, I, I did. did. To get an ice pick. I an was ice pick. there. What did you need it for? Oh, I... right. Um, I was confused before. The... The fuse box was locked. That's why I needed the ice pick. To open it. Miss Roy, you do realize this isn't the time or place to be confusing details, don't you? <laughs> Silly me! Did you touch Sorry! Poop poop beat up! <laughs> did you touch anything? No, I didn't. Wait, did I? <laughs> I think I didn't. I don't think I did. No, I don't think I actually did. Did I? No, nothing. That's weird. It sure looks like someone poked around the crime scene. Well, it oh, wasn't well. me. I didn't. more once the fingerprint analysis comes did in. Did I? Won't we? The pearls? So. Why does the pearls matter? What did you do after restoring the power? I took the elevator down to the lobby. That's where I called the police. Like. Do you remember what you said to the operator? You're going the to jail, bitch? Place. I'm a lesbian. I want to go to jail. I get no, my pussy touched and tasted twice a night. You said there's a man dead. He's been murdered. That's possible. What makes you so sure it was murder? Well, because what the fuck do you mean, you little idiot fucker? Like... Like, what the fuck does he mean? Just tell him the truth, but now I feel like I can't. I don't like these options. I should be able to say I've overheard guests fighting and seen things in their rooms. Like, tell the truth. Okay, only if you guys tell me the truth. Is my nose as big as you guys make it seem? Yes. Thank you for being honest. I... I've been... This makes us look so auspicious, for that. I didn't think you'd admit it. No. <laughs> Fuck you, you motherfucker! We found pictures of you snooping around. Oh. Oh, that's right. Uh, now, <laughs> unless you want me to arrest you for violating your guest's privacy, <laughs> I suggest you tell me everything you know. <laughs> All right. Let's start with the victim. I don't know wife, anything. Marcella Cruz. I'm Apparently, innocent. Apparently, she left in quite a hurry this morning. What can you tell me about her? She's gay. Um, she's actually a gay girl. She's having an affair, but it's not what you think. She's been in love with another woman since college. Yeah, gay shit. They've been apart two for two women, than two ten years. Four ten. Yes, yes, I know all about Mrs. Cruz and Mrs. Beaumont's sexual deviance. Have you ever witnessed them engaging in immoral behavior? How dare you, Mr. Merday? You know, intimate. No, I haven't. No. And did you hear them discuss their deviant ways in front of Mrs. Beaumont's son, perhaps? Imagine what kind of effect such perversion have on I beg your pardon, Merday! I didn't hear anything. Did you hear them express their hatred of men? Did they ever talk about using violence against men? Did you hear them speak ill of Mr. Cruz? Never! I don't know what this means. 
take us to- I haven't. I really haven't heard them do that. Which one means I haven't? Does this one mean I haven't? What are you trying to imply? That Mrs. Cruz killed her husband because she hates men? I've seen it before from lesbians. Oh, that shouldn't be a crime! Hate. Men kill their life. wives all the time because they That's secretly hate right. women. Oh, and you think now you it's do? not fair. Then please, enlighten me. She's brave enough to be with the one she loves. That doesn't make her a criminal. That doesn't mean she killed okay, her. Okay, honestly, we should not be I'm defending this bitch so much. One of them, Miss Roy, since you're... We should not be defending her so much. We don't even know this hoe. Like, I'm not trying to go to jail for some random bitch with a boy haircut who wears Tim's. Like, I don't need, I don't want to know. So eager to defend these And deviants. I worry about your ability to do your job, <laughs> Detective, since you seem to be such a- Enough! <laughs> Now get the hell out of here. Oh my Man, god. Men are so violent. I can't. I'm scared. My lips are really low down. If she was my Sim in Sims 4, I would just drag them the fuck up because they're so low down. They're about to fall off her chin. Everybody says I'm a good girl officer with a good little pussy. <laughs> oh, Lady in Red! Bernard was strangely chipper on the phone. Oh my god. <laughs> that can't be a good sign. Sophie needs a fucking me. wig. What are you trying to say? She's life plus Cindy coded? The atmosphere is so <laughs> different in here. Will it ever feel like Oh, over here. I think I a little fireplace. What's over here? Oh, they got a little walking worm. Oh, they got a little small table that's meant for children. Oh, what's over here? A pillar. Da -da -da. How much longer is this game? Is this a good place to save it and quit it? Because I still want to play Overwatch. Order up. Sexy. Or are we almost done? If we're almost done, I'll just finish it, you know, like. It'll probably be a while before the hotel reopens. I have to Without clean. Eugene, the lobby will be a swimming pool by the end of the month. Will <laughs> the rest of the building even be standing? Okay, what do I have to do? I'll need a mop to clean the puddle. Why am I cleaning? Are you kidding me? I just assisted in a murder, and I have the murder weapon still on me. Like, why do I have to clean? Put a song on the jukebox? I don't think I have any money. I think I'm broke as a joke. Oh, they blocked it off, even though the other hallway is not blocked off at all, so you can just walk through. That's a cigarette, not a jukebox. They used to sell cigarettes in a vending machine? They should do that with vape. That'd be so convenient. Oh my god, someone should invent that. Like a vape vending machine. That would eat. I really don't want to clean. That's me cleaning my little boy snatch for George Washington. That's what it sounds like. Oh my god. Ugh, go to oh! hell. Beth. Hey. Are you okay? I'm out of a job. But other than that, why did she get fired? Mentioned. What? No. I, I hope you're luckier than I am. Come join me when he's done with you, all right? I'll be questioning my life choices on the mezzanine. Yeah, yeah, okay. She walks like she just got fucked. We're gonna have to seduce him with our girl plunge. <laughs> with our kooka hole. Ooh. Ah, Miss Roy. Too much eyeliner for a Come minute. Come in. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose you know why you're here? <laughs> Don't play dumb with me. You know you want me. <laughs> no. I'm not sure, actually. I have to play dumb. Your phone call was a bit vague. Vogue. Yes, well, I prefer to have this conversation in person. Okay. We've been getting a lot of press lately. And not the good kind. No. I wouldn't expect you to understand the position I'm in. No. But I assure you, <laughs> it's quite uncomfortable. 
to have one's life's work blown away like that. It's a hotel. All thanks to some sexual deviance and a nut job. <laughs> it's obvious to me now that I haven't been firm enough. For guests of such morals to be comfortable booking a few nights here and, and, and committing such a horrid act? <sighs> No, things need to change. No more women this working means here. Elevating our standards to the <laughs> highest possible level. And it starts with the people working here. It starts with you. With me? Yes. From what I've heard, you've been quite the example. Oh, so neighbor. I did good on my cleaning. Clean rooms. If I miss guests. stuff, would I have got fired? I take my job very seriously, sir. As you should. We'll oh, see period. for the future, but that. for now, you'll be allowed to continue working here. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not done. The police have finished their investigation and left a mess on the fifth floor. I want you to clean it up. You want me to go back there? Yes. Why not? I found a dead body on that floor. I'm... I'm not going back. I'll make this simple for you. If you don't do it, you're fired. You got Beth fired? Forget it. I didn't get Beth fired! What did I do to fucking Beth besides munching her little kooka? I need this job. I need this fucking job. No, you don't. Girl, quit. I think he should tell us if the body is still there. If the body is still there and I can secretly harvest some organs, then I can make a quick buck. But if it's not there, then I'm going to quit. Do you guys think the body is still there? Yes or no? No. Then I'm quitting. You can't fire me. Because... I quit! Because I quit. <laughs> and I have no chin. Sure. I fire you, you quit. It's all the same to me. Just oh make sure to God. empty your locker before the end of the month. Oh, fuck. That'll be all. Now I have to go to the fucking battered woman shelter. Oh, fuck. Why did you get... Now I'm unemployed! <laughs> It's giving Hex Joshua. This is horrible. Bad ending. Hey. Hey, hey. gay girl. With man Why arms. Why weak? <laughs> yeah. So, what Tokyo did Tony drop with you? <laughs> well, he was being kind of a jerk. So, I quit. You what? I quit. <laughs> I figured there was no point in staying if you were leaving. Oh, I didn't even think of I that. I appreciate the solidarity, but you really didn't have to do that. I think it's for the best. It is. I'm done cleaning and snooping and being a Did stalker. Bernard say why he was firing you? Ugh. He was going on and on about keeping deviance out of the hotel. So, <laughs> I may have lost my cool a little. That's a right. Little. Gay and straight I told him does not I was mix. one of those deviants he was so afraid of. Eve That's a human me. rights violation! Someone call the Better Business Bureau! I know you'll bounce back. What makes me be gay? Girl dinner? A dead man? Bouncing, you're well, right. Well, I'm not one bit worried about you. I know you'll be just fine. My yeah. eyeliner's uneven. I do have a cat-like ability to land on my feet. And I have a little think cat of all the good times legs. I have away a from Bernard. Pussy, hmm. Little girl clutch. <laughs> he turns into a <laughs> my girl clutch that only I can get out of him. Oh, like rouge, <laughs> rouge, no merde. It's time for new challenges. I could see myself owning my own establishment. Oh. To the right kind of crowd. A bathhouse. Believe it or not, I do enjoy the company of people, just not, you know, the stuck up in a bathhouse clientele of this. Prestige. But for gay girls. But so like a spa. Maybe if I were behind the counter of, say, a bar instead of a reception. Oh, house. she wants to open um. <laughs> I don't know. A bar. Is that silly. No, full of gay not. people. In like fact, a Starbucks. You might be yes. Perfect for it. You're the most charming person I know. Okay, <laughs> lay down the heat, Mama. You're gonna scare her Thank off. You. I'm really glad you're in my life. Oh Me too. Oh my god. Are we gonna. <gasps> Can I 
care about any of that. I'm good. What do you think will happen to them? <laughs> Who? Sorry, my mind wanders sometimes. I meant Paul, Anne, and Marcel. Was there an ending where I, I go to jail? Or no? Released? Yeah, I think so. Paul will probably become a yes. photographer. His portrait of Why? Because I have a weird haircut? Entitled The Inconspicuous Maid. It will sell for millions. Oh my god. <laughs> Is that so? Yeah. And Anne and Marcella will ride into the sunset on the back of... Well, who got apples. convicted, you guys? Do we get to find out? French. They'll be constantly followed Two by... Two jobless lesbians. Oh, that's like a lot of you guys in chat. <laughs> that's why you guys love like them. Because they're jobless lesbians just like you. I want them to be happy. Hmm. Me too. <laughs> Oh my god. And then someone shoots Beth in the head. But she does a little dance, like a little parrot first. And then she lays an egg and it hatches into a new Beth. A younger Beth. And then we have to raise baby Beth knowing she used to be our girlfriend. <laughs> the Northern Voice! The Montre! Three conspirators charged! Who's that gay guy? Wait, who's that other girl? Who's that? Beth? Paul. Oh my god. You know what? I never learned who Lindsay was. I'm gonna be so honest. I never really learned who Lindsay was. <laughs> who? Who? Oh my god, their green needles are huge. Oh fuck. The little boy has to go back with his abusive dad! Did I fuck up? Did I fuck up? I did? This ending is horrible. Where? Oh, and look, now I have no job! And I'm broke as a fucking joke! I'm getting evicted! Oh, you guys! Completed the game. At least I'm a gay girl with a boy hair girlfriend. Oh my god. Oh fuck. I'd say that ending was like moderate, probably middle of the ground. There's a homeless little boy who gets hit by his dad. Two innocent women are in jail. But other than that, you know, we're broke as a joke, homeless. But, you know, at least we kissed a, an older woman. I'll take it. And love wins. That was actually a really good game. I really enjoyed that game. Why Morgan had random photos of Sophie. You know, I'm not sure why he had other other photos of Sophie still. I'm not really sure. I got confused in the middle, but honestly, the saving grace of this Let's Play was this right here. This really pulled it together for me and honestly got me exactly where I needed to be. And I could go back and reference it several times and it really helped. It's all in the notes, baby. That was so cute, though. I hope they make another game. I think this game is popular, right? They'll probably make another one. That was super cute. And if this one does well, the next one will probably have even a bigger budget. And this game is definitely indie, but it didn't give me low budge. The voice acting was good. The mouths didn't, like, mouth the words, but I don't really ever care about that. Um, the voice acting was good. I just wish they had a bigger budget for character models, so we could have met more of the characters in the beginning because then I wouldn't have struggled so much to know who was who but overall I liked it I give it like an 8 out of 10 I really enjoyed it this was a good this was a good one this was a good one
Oh my god, a success for the girls. Can you look up the other endings? This actually felt like it had budget. Yeah, it didn't. Oh, is that why, Astrology? Because they were speaking Frenchy, And I only speak American? Oh my god, the French are so crazy. Another game finished.